yeah, I'll, I'll I'll click the go live button. Um, just need to move a couple of things around. Oh, wait there, then, darling. Come here, give us it here. Uh, with this one mainly. Come here. We want to have I'll it so everybody it can you. see it, but also it doesn't get in the way of um, our faces. I'm putting it at the top. Fixed it. Stop. <laughs> ah, transition. There you go. Cool. Right. The score lines. So, um, hello and welcome, everybody, to the live stream from myself and from Mackham. We've got two guests on today. We've got DJ FSAFC and Jacob Aviard. Um, so, Jacob is a uh, very, very <laughs> uh, keen Sunderland fan. Um, he's really good with keeping us up to date with the score lines throughout our last oh how many how many months may like five six months of streams it's been been a pleasure so i'm, I'm really happy that you're coming on today um, yeah it's nice to have um more people yeah and um if if dj does need to nip to the loo again it's not awkward silence for the entire time uh we we have got um we have got some banter that can continue throughout um myself dj and jacob are all watching the game um on our meeting um, but in terms of predictions, uh, should we go through them one by one? First up, uh, we, should we do it alphabetically, or should we do? Do you want to go first as the, the newest guest, Jacob? There you go. We'll go go with you for your, your predictions. Three one Sunderland. Three one Sunderland. Perfect. I'm just going to chop anybody who puts in predictions down. So yeah, pen down. DJ, your score predictions for today. For today, yeah. Three and out of the lads. Three, one, and for me, um, as as per my uh, predictions video, normal, I'm going to say it, two nil to Sunderland. So all three of us are back in the. I was going to say we're all back in the red and white army, but that doesn't make much sense considering Stoke playing red and white as well. Um, so we're playing the we're, we're back in the boys in blue today. Um, three nil, DJ. Um, two nil. Me, anybody else in this in the uh, in the chat that wants to give their predictions, feel free to do so. You might get points on the table. You never know. Uh, Neil Harrison says, "Hello, oh, well, lads." Uh, Keith Lupton, welcome back, mate. Perth, Perth, Australia, and Mike from Melbourne, Australia. Mental. Yes, hello, guys. It's welcome. It's uh, very late in the evening for you guys now. It's got to be like nearly nearly midnight. So keen keen to get this on. I do have. Um, I can put on now because it's the pre-match commentary for uh, Alex Neil. Um, I don't think it'll be like all season, right, but the time to find where the championship so is. Can, I think because that, so listen. many teams don't actually know where they are in the pecking order, what happens Man is Fish, welcome along, buddy. Nice to everybody can beat have you come along. See, so you've changed your profile picture in the last couple of minutes. A 1-0 win for down. Sunderland as well. Nice. Um, I, I, I agree with that, though. Lads, what are, you, what are you thinking about our defences in terms of keeping... Clean sheets. Um, there you go. Need a couple of points, you know, maybe a Jacob, what do you reckon about clean sheet up, option? Because you've won three one. Why, why don't you think we're going for a clean point. sheet today? Um, I think it's still need starting out a bit. Alex Neil but there speaking in the press conference ahead of today's game. We still a bit of a risky thing our defence, but it's not like our defence in seventeen eighteen season. Not that bad, but still a bit more work to do at that. But I think. We'll manage today. I, I, I agree, mate. It's it's one of those things where, with our defence, it is a bit um, hit and miss, like a little bit more miss than hit for more, for the most part. But you can't really um, you can't really negate some one off incidents that that happen. Um, DJ, I did mute you for a second, so I can unmute you. You've unmuted yourself now, right? Mm. Alan McAnally, yeah. I think you're still muted, mate. I don't know. On on me on Google Meet, I think on Google Meet you're still muted. <laughs> right, I, this is going chaotic. There you go, uh, Neil. I uh, sorry, Are Niall. Are you showing the game on Discord, Anne? Uh No, I'm showing it on Google Meet. Are you? Yes. <laughs> That's why I've said I've said you got that up. But you'll see oh, right. um yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Um, see Danny Collins giving his pre match interview. So um 
think we've got a do, we do have a couple more um predictions in there. So Niall says two nil to the lads. There's a lot of lot of clean um clean score lines for us. Born born and riot. Oh lucky kid. <laughs> Lola, that was a very strong burst into the room. Were you feeling messed up? Go on. <laughs> Doesn't say you can watch it. It just says audio. Uh, uh, Kieran, I am. I am. I am in Belgium at the minute. <laughs> That's why I can watch it on SFC. Uh, hello. There we go. What do you want? She's really needy for for some attention. The lineup and the formation. I'll pull that up. Um, there's. Anybody want to uh, predict who's uh, who's in and out of the lineup? Considering we do have uh, some <coughs> forced changes before I uh, find out the exact people. No, no. It's going to chat a lot. All right. Um, what do you, Lola? Right. So I'm going to interact with that. Who do you think is going to be making the starting lineup? DJ, go. <laughs> just to trap man she said so i'm just getting set up here guys so oh got yeah okay right i've got them up you don't have to you don't have to make some um terrible predictions so starting goal obviously anthony patterson uh we're playing three at the back with Sirkin, baff in the middle and or nine in the midfield we've got clock on the left wing metetia and embleton as holding midfielders and gooch on the right richard playing as cam and then sims and stewart up front so basically the only change since last week is oh no there's two changes there's Matete and 09 and this in the starting 11 um what's your thoughts on that for a three four one two good i saw it on instagram and i just thought good lineup now yeah got same same way so uh, yeah I think it, for yeah. definite he'll score for definite sims will score yeah yeah Put, put your money where your mouth is. <laughs> um, what's it called? Are you joining us on Monday then, Jacob? Yeah, I'll try. Yeah. If you can, if you, if you can, that's it, it's a nice sleep yeah. loss when you are, right? But you know where we're at. <laughs> right, sorry, I've lost the, the chat thread. Ah, there we are. Um, Metete has, uh, has to be changed. Uh, Metete has to be. He's changed the game, in my opinion. What? When he came on, I, I <laughs> should we talk about our last result, mate? The um, the two one loss to Sheffield United. I think I was very confused as to the sub choices that were being made, and then instantly they worked. So I was like, "This make like we're making more subs to go more defensive," um, but we were two nil down. So I was like, "This what what on earth is Alex Neil doing?" Um. But I think you're right. Um, Teddy did change the game positively for us last week. <laughs> He's just pushing out my chair. Uh, still no Billy Wright. Um, so uh, Nan says. Oh, and is there any chance there. you can turn your mic down? Or how can I turn you down a bit? You seem to be really overpowering at my end. Um, you can do that on your inputs. Um, right, hold on. I'm too quiet on my stream if I turn myself down. Otherwise, oh, so yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. All right, we are four minutes away from kickoff. Yeah. There you go. Cool. Right, I think I've got everything set up the way I need it to be. I just want to make sure that we keep an eye on chat as well. Um, so hopefully that didn't kick you guys off. Doesn't look like it did. Perfect. Yes, no, it did. It did kick you off. <laughs> Stop it. Behave. I want to be able to see chat and then see you as well. I might have to do this. Leicester and Southampton today. Um, In the Premier League? Uh, yeah. Is it at down. Leicester? Yeah. Uh, I, um, sorry. Just want to make sure you... Definitely still on. Yep, perfect. Right. Apologies for that. Um, I don't need to see the Google <laughs> Google me because I can see you in OBS. Um, so Leicester have had a slower start to the season as uh, compared to what like they normally do. Um, what what's your money on on that one? If you if you were, 
putting it down. Maybe two one Leicester. Two one Leicester. Two one. Do you think Vardy's coming back at it um, strong now, or is he is he on his way out? I mean, he's just signed a new contract till twenty twenty four. So he's not on the way out then. <laughs> no, he's not. He he's feels not like it, moment. but he's not actually. No. Yeah, uh, the teams are coming out for the uh, pre match autographs. Um, Kyle Maven in the chats has asked how many games is Dan Neal suspended for. So I think. One, I any, think. any, I thought any red cards was an in like because it was a straight red card. I thought that was an instant free game ban. Is that not I right? Thought it was one. I think someone said one actually. It might have been I'm watching Michael Bowers and he said one actually. I don't know. It tends to be free, but it tends yeah, to be free. Yeah. Okay. Up, okay. Um, I'm not. Sure I'm not 100 sure. Last night, um, Michael Bowers. <laughs> yeah, we we were being miscreants in it though, weren't we? <laughs> the subject the subject of tampons and periods it was weird well, sweet, get down son yeah but you brought That's it there <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah um anyways right the lineups are actually uh, out for stoke as well does anybody have it to hand because i can't see it it's quite small on my screen um i think stoke are lined up exactly uh, uh, very similar to us, actually. They're in a three-five-two formation, so they'll have more of a Rory solid Delap's line in the middle of the pitch. Him. Rory lap. No, his son does now. Oh, his son! His son's playing now. Um, he's called Liam Delap. Uh, Mike's in. Still no Bailey Wright on the pitch. I find I think that's really bizarre because um, Bailey well, Wright is there. happened there, aren't there? There's someone not right. Yeah, because are they trying to keep Billy Wright as fresh as possible for the um... later on in the season? Li maybe till October, November, December. Are they trying to protect? Till... Yeah, but the World Cup is he's in them playing in the World Cup. Are they uh, like for Australia? They... Yeah. Yeah. So I, I don't know if they're trying to keep him like as fit as possible for that, or we should be kind of selfish with that, right? Because if he goes to the World Cup, gets injured in the World Cup, what we've done for them is. A little bit, I don't know. I, I think anybody thinking Australia is going to be um, a little bit upset because um, they, they're not going to win it. Australia are not going to win the World Cup. Like, <laughs> there's a lot of miracles in football that's going to happen before that happens. Right. I've turned on the Sunland audio. Son sold, 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 sold out the away end as usual. There's loads down there today. Like. Um, apparently, it's 2,900 in the away end. According to Twitter, welcome to what you expecting FCFC from Sunderland Live today, then lads? Are you expecting Sunderland. a <coughs> nervy start coming out the blocks or in the Skybet Championship this time down at the Bet 365 against bit of a mix, Sunderland. to be honest. One of your former clubs there, mix, yeah, I'd say. And a stadium of which you've probably played both a sides few will be at each other as well. It's be a very attacking yeah, game. Would it be yeah. concerning and if, if we lost today, would be worried? Yeah, there was think? not. Perhaps a little bit mm, of a not too concerning, concerning but it'd be a disappointing result. I think we should the way we be eaten still realistically. I'm just going to change the league table now to live standings as well. Um, and then it should be called in. Perfect. So we've got all the stats, we've got all the chat, everything's up. You can, can you see the game perfectly fine as well? Uh, no yeah. Dwight Gale as well, that's correct. Um, I think Dwight's on, Dwight Gale is on the bench for Stoke. I don't think they're going to be starting him in a match that... Yeah. I don't know. doesn't mean all that much to Stoke, I think. It means more to us. We want to win. That battle on that touchline. Lindy no, Gugis that's a fucking, right that's a, that's a lie. Every every on the left. game, every player wants to win their games that they're in. It's kicked off indeed, yes. Yes, yeah, so we're a minute in. Kick off. Quite well this season, um, so, so how are you keeping an eye on the scores around the, the doors, highlights highlights Jacob? So far this season, just the way we oh, soccer Saturday. Really I mean, I've turned volume down a bit so that it doesn't, in case you get copyright, but... Yeah, it's getting worse YouTube for copyright and stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Fulham won more against Brentford. Just scored. Fulham have took the lead at Brentford. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Um, I'm going to have to hide half my screen so I don't see the... Because the um, text print is about 29 seconds ahead of SFC. Is that a better sound? Just let us know, yeah? There you go. Cool. Right. 
Got the channel. Can you guys hear me all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Crystal clear, mate. Okay. The Stoker taking a throw in on the... I don't know. Would you class that as their, that's their left-hand side? Um, our right. My left. <laughs> Your left, yeah. So on the far side from the camera. Um, we're kicking from... Right to left, they're kicking from right, uh, left to right. Um, Lugo 9's now got a throw in, long up the wing, and I don't think we'll be uh, doing too much for that. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not, not a... Um, oh my god, Patterson with a fuck up. Oh no. Tries to clear it out, back it straight into the attacking player, but... They fucked around with it that much that they didn't have a chance to have an actual shot. That was a let off for Bailey, uh, for Patterson. Uh, so. Mad mistake would have been going crazy with that, wouldn't he? Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, so Keith's saying Australia are not going to win the World Cup. Oh, Winding a one up against Rochdale. Um, <laughs> yeah, Niles, Niles just said all you can use are Sun and fans. I mean, that's just us everywhere, isn't it? I mean, to be fair, do you find that home fans are a little bit more quiet than the away fans just like every time? Whenever we're away, we can't hear the home fans. When we're the away fans, it's just us. Yeah, but when we have. Because um, I remember uh, the West Ham game uh, a couple of years back, pre pre pandemic, and like the home fans were just like nail biting all the time, and rather than actually chanting and that, and all you could hear was the West Ham fans. So I don't know if that's like common thing, like the away fans are just louder. Yeah. Oh, Burnley won nil up against Blackpool. Oh, very nice. Okay. Um, let's see if that. Burnley. Burnley. I said 1 0 for that game. You said 4 0. DJ. 4 0. Well, we're on the way. We're on our way. Uh, it just needs a full time whistle now. We should be all you can hear. You don't want to underestimate them or anyone really, but Blackpool are just. I'm just looking at uh, Patterson's rushed clearance there. It's shite on it. it it, Liam Delaf, at the back, we well. look, oh well, my god, how's that not a foul? Referee plays oh on. Delaf Need continues. another goal, I think, get Looking John McLaughlin. Shot away, it's closed down by Jim well. Tete. That was a foul. I'm sorry, well, that was definitely a foul on uh, Lugo Nye. And the referee's like, nice shot off. It's a corner. No, the Aston Villa are winning at Palace. Oh, no. Oh, it okay. all stalk at the minute, like. It is 100% all stalk, mate. Um, there Luke I, and well, that's what we do, though. Sometimes we come out with the blocks out of one's blazing, don't we? Of it back, but, yeah. yeah. Luke feels he's fouled um, by Liam. But that might be Stoke can be tired in the second half. They could annihilate us in first half, and then we the can come out and... The corner. Always oh, Gary Bennett's then. chirping away. He's uh, saying uh, we need to deal with the situation. We're not dealing with things at the minute at the back. I mean, he's right. It's a bit morny, but he is right. Um, scrappy at the back. Lugo 9 looks lost there. It, he, he looks like he's about to go for a header and then just backs out of it. Really bizarre. That was a free header. Uh, Super Rock and Roll, welcome from Alberta. Friggin' else. Do you think that was a foul on Lugo 9 there? I think that yeah. Are you not are you not watching it, it on our stream? Because you you're oh, like no, literally a minute it's, behind. It's it's no, it's sure like mad, so I've got it on the telly. I've got yeah. He actually gets his body across him, he's in a good position um, to deal with it. Yeah, you're about to see the Luco nine not jumping for a, a cross into the box. Um at about five minutes ten oh, seconds in. Top. It's kinda I don't know, it's, it is all, it is 100% all stalk at the minute. Well. Uh, the stats... Jacob, what's it like at your end? Is the match tougher well, for you when you're watching it? Uh, it's fairly decent, actually. It's just... It's, it's, like it's got a bit of... No, it's a bit like... It does stop at an odd bit, but it's mainly just all right, I think. Oh, so, good. Alessi challenge to pass it to Sims. Sims down to Pritchard. Pritchard looking up. Uh, Stewart was asking for it on the far side of the pitch, but that would have been a really, like, worldy pass if that went through. <laughs> if, it, if he went for it, at least. Luke O9 looks a little bit lost at the moment. Modern Bonnie Lads from Overcast Edmonton, Canada. Overcast, yeah, I've read that out, mate. <laughs> Super rogue or roll. Well oh, well, you've had a, you've had a, you've had a double. Uh, yeah. 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 A bit of the ball. Alice of equalised. Oh, really? Over the top for one, one nine. Just a yard. 
Follow over the top by 09 to Ellis Sims. Nothing coming over to keep a collector quite calmly. Um, yeah, like I said, these stats here do not lie. You've got 53% um, possession for Stork. All the shots for Stork. Yeah. I wonder why the match is like stuttery at my end. Do you think it's changed in seconds, do you think, Probably it's made. Don't worry about it. While, while we're doing this... this Finally, I think the referee's yeah, going to bring okay. it back for a foul. I think Michael O'Neill felt there was a couple of fouls before I think that. around with some settings about that. Yeah, I just want to call out. Thank you very much for 27 people coming in, into the uh, into the stream. Welcome along, everyone. Um, where are we at? Absolutely. I just, I just want to get your stream up as well, DJ, so I can catch any chats in there as well. Yeah, because has been physical, and if he gets a yellow card early on... Picked up a yellow, didn't he, on, uh, on Wednesday night as well, I think. But yes, especially early Elite, on, as you say. All round, all better. That looks so much yeah, better. Yeah. Uh, you need to change it from match summary to statistics on your OBS, mate. But other than that, you're all good to go. Especially when you're in the team. Yeah, well, I'll change it for next time. We're all right, there's another number. Um, I, I guess. We always take over everywhere we go. <laughs> everywhere we go. Dark, isn't there? See a few empty seats at Duck. To be fair, if I was a Stoke fan, um, and I do work with quite a couple of Stoke fans because I live in the West Midlands, um, they're not really happy with how they've started this season. Um, nah. If, if this season was going to be the season that they were going to kick on and try and challenge for the Prem, they would have already, already done it by now. Um, but it, it's just a lot of fizzling efforts from, from them. Oh, cheers it down. Cheers it down. We've always been a physical side of Stoke. Oh, yeah. Been quite... oh, I, say now, I need to change the league table thing on OBS, though, it's not active, is it? No, you know, you've got it on standings. You need it on the live standings. Will Smallbone gets it back. Can he get there? He can't. It's just too much on that. Okay. Too much of a... Yeah, I'm not sure too much of an effect. He is balder than John Joe Shelby. If Elliot's in there, you need to get <laughs> him on the ball. Fucking hell. I didn't think that was team. possible. We, we um, encouraged them, as I said there, with a couple of mistakes, maybe, and they allowed them into the, the game. Mark's secret room. So the Sunderland the fans there look play, very, very bold. To get him on there see if he can start creating There's definitely goals in this game, though. 100%. Could be a 2 2 draw, it could be one of those drawing games where it's like a 3 3 2, two you know. The Bristol game, the, yeah, the QPR game, that kind of thing. Oh, what a ball! Oh. Wasn't for Phil Jagielka's foot there. Would you be happy with a point today? Um, yeah. Meh, it'd be a bit like. We've got work to do if we do draw. Oh, do you know what? If it's a nil-nil draw, it's a, it's a bit, different yeah. question. I'd say yes because that's our first clean sheet. I'd be more happy with a, a nil-nil point draw than a score draw because that's again more defensive issues that we're going to consider. We keep clean sheet. We know we can keep clean sheets in games when we we score. But mm. Bowers likes a clean sheet, doesn't he? <laughs> we all <laughs> like a clean sheet. Yeah. But well, based on how Patterson's played so far, I'm not 100% sure he's 100% in the game. Looks a little bit lost. He sometimes comes on stream, doesn't he, Bowers? But it depends, because sometimes he goes to the matches. He's, um, he said on his stream last night that he's went to the match. Him the yeah. Yeah. Well, what a save from Patterson! Holy fuck! Oh, God. He's the next Jim Montgomery. He's the next Jim Montgomery. Yeah. Are you about to see this? He just needs to command his box more, but his overall skills are superb, aren't they? Across, but it's a and he's young, isn't he? Young, yeah. He's a good strike as well. 21. Come in. Anthony Patterson but the, tr the trouble is, though, where the likes of us, it's like we can never keep all the players in grow because when he comes good, he'd be gone, he'd go to another club, he'd go to a Premier League club or whatever, and it's... We might be a Premier League... We might be a Premier League club when he comes good, mate, so you never know. Well... We'll yeah. see about that. Is there any more what goals around the league, Jacob? Second around the leagues? So any in League One? Any in the Championship? Well, I think there's only one goal in the Championship so far, and that's league the... Two. Salford are winning away at Doncaster. Near post. It's back out to Thompson. But there's not really any... I mean, Yeovil are winning. Wrexham are winning at home against Maidstone 1-0, but... Off one of the Stoke lads back to win. No League Offside. One or Championship. Offside for Stoke. Got to make sure we're well yeah. organised from corners today. That one we conceded in midweek. 
Oh, Alex it's Neal doesn't look happy, does he? What are you doing? It looks like he's tie-dying his neighbour's curtains, doesn't it? Will you stop with the tie-dye? You're inviting people to tie-dye United. 2-0 Burnley now. Come on, I'm going to go. I'm going to overtake Anthony the league table here. 2-0. Oh, we both went for a win. It's just if 4 nils right on that one. Tom's at the door. Uh, knocking. Sims tries to head it on for Stewart. But yeah. Oh. Yeah, done well there, Sim. Ross just on his heels. Maybe just, <laughs> Ellis is going to win the header. I don't know. Sunderland, Sunderland are coming out with Something a bit of a whimper this behind. afternoon. I'm not I'm not really impressed with the first 12 minutes no. so far. What about you guys? But I mean, I think if Stoker are attacking it? like this, yes, they could be tired in second half. So shaking his head, it doesn't agree one, with the decision. But it, it, I do understand why it's worrying. It but they, they haven't scored yet. They haven't scored yet. So there is always that. I get, I get that. Yeah, but it's, it's kind of yeah. A team like Stoke shouldn't be doing this to someone. It should be realistically all the way around. We should be at them. Luke Nine's booked already. Yeah, he's not going to last the whole night. He did a right tackle at playoffs, didn't he, against Wickham? Oh, yeah. Well, that's the kind of thing we like. Mike's saying it doesn't sound like it's been a. Uh, like it's been in it's half at all. Afternoon. Like, what's going on? I, I, I don't know. The defence looks a little bit out of place. Um, our attack is. Looks like one for tie dye curtains, doesn't he, Luke? Or nine? <laughs> I think somebody needs to just. I think we need a tie dye kit next season. Just, just for the shits and giggles of it. Thompson. <laughs> Leeds have got a tie dye away kit then. Looks like something's gone wrong. Unless, he, unless he's pushing, pushing the um, stoke player out of the way. The referee the clearly way. seeing it. There's been a red card at Wigan. Joe Bennett. Oh. That's huge. Who are they playing again? Wigan. Oh, it. It. Patterson, clean Patterson save. Parries it. Patterson's kept us in this. He's had a he's had a bit of a wobbler in the first two three minutes. Um, but yeah, no, he, he's a solid punch. No, his screen's gone. I mean, it's going to the shot. He just parries it away from goal. Your um, screens have gone off, lads. Uh, you need to tab into Google Chrome. Uh, we've got to wake up, or at least something we're holding off. If if it's sustained against Swansea at the Liberty Stadium. Clips a nice ball inside. Mommy gone, gone shopping, Ooh. Ooh. I'll get some okay. tonight. Some nice cream tonight, okay? That's that's really good for me, mate. Uh, I said Luton 1 0. <laughs> Got the score lines just here, just in case anybody thinks I'm bullshitting at, at the end. <laughs> I'm happy. Um, Wimbledon are winning in League 2 away at Crawley. Crawley? Oh, that's, yeah. oh, yeah, I was, I was like. I added this double take on that sentence there, mate, because I forgot Wimbledon got relegated when we got promoted. I was like, Wimbledon, are you sure? <laughs> oh, that's better from Luke. That's it, the Pritchard, mate. Or Embo. That's it. Oh, he tried it. Lads, you're not showing up on my chat. Hans? What do you mean? You're not showing up on my chat. What do you mean? See Luke go nine there. Um, drops. I think just, if he drops the, it in behind, I think Ross is looking the for the Google ball Meet. Just, uh, nobody's shown up on pictures. I've got a picture of you. My video's on. It's your, your internet speed, then, mate. That's your internet speed. That's your internet speed because he's both showing up on mine. That's your local. That's your local end. I can't pick up the information or data fast enough. But. Uh, Nothing to worry about. We've got our pictures. I look nice in my suit and tie. Do Jacob likes his name. profile picture as well. So <laughs> no, I've got them back on. <laughs> them back on. Uh, I think your Slightly your Google Alex one is still uh, the like picture with you, Luke, you and Luke or nine. Oh, that was after the uh, when we beat Wickham three one at home because I got invited yeah, yeah. to the Bradley Lowry section at VIP seats and. Nice. Good, that. It's, a, it's not what you know, it's who you know. <laughs> yeah. And I met Akin I met Akin Femra as well. You know, like when players going on coach. Yeah, yeah. So many headers, doesn't he coming back and oh. yeah. helping out defensively? Plus four. Uh we do have a oh no, you've already called that out. That's the Luton Town goal against Swansea. That sees um them leapfrog each other, right? So Luton now climb up into seventeenth? <laughs> That's a shit start of the season. 
Um, oh, that's gone straight to Ellis Sims. It's bounced Sims have a shot, mate. Won't fancy, oh, but tipped. Guys are playing Alex Pritchard. Oh, oh, oh for Stoke him. fucking up. Embleton. Leighton Orient winning a culture. He's looking for a shot there. Oh, too much, too much in front of it. Yeah, just... oh, that was better effort from Sunderland. Not gonna lie. Just needed to actually put your foot through it. Put now. Starting to wake up. Yeah, I think we will start to come into the game, but with it, the home team Sunderland usually do sort of. Um, the back oh, there, that's giving me a yellow. What is going on? Matetia there, man. Yeah, it's yellow. Played it. Yeah, Fuck it out. A couple of yards to the Giddy. side of him. That's <laughs> in the book. Tete's in the book then. We're all over the place, says Gary Bennett. That's We're all over the place. Minutes. Sloppy yeah, passing. Sloppy, sloppy passing. Um, Danny Bart played the one out of play yeah. earlier on. I, I, I'm sloppy sticking to my last sentence I said about four minutes ago, five Pritchard, minutes ago. Just, off each other. We're not on it. We're not fully switched on to this match. I don't know what's happened, but... Shot Everybody looks again. nervous. Maybe saying that could have been a booking earlier on, but I don't think it was. It's currently nil nil at the moment. Sorry, go again, Jacob, mate. Currently nil nil at Bramall Lane. Sheffield United and Blackburn. Yeah. God, we haven't been able to string two passes together. I uh, can see a red card again. I mean, the way we're going. We've got two of our players already on yellows. Delivers. It's Ellis Sims who's back there defending. It's happened before against Stoke West Brown. John got sent Cleans. off again. Oh, Plymouth for 1 0 up against Forest Green. Uh, what do you think of Forest Green as a team? I find them really bizarre. Yeah, darling. Good. I mean, I went to see them because we've, I've got a friend who's a Tramia fan and they were playing in National League playoffs 2017 and it was 3 1 to Forest Green. And down and puts an early one in. And quite, well, nine gets ahead of it and second. Clears it. Who think ball maybe or nice. team that time it's wastes the all that? Do they look professional now though? That's that's the thing. Because they've been a non-league team for, for a long time. Well, they won really. and they went into League Two and it's. I'm happy for them as a club because they're not a big club at all. They're smaller than Luton, aren't they? Yeah, they're a vegan club as well. A vegan club. Yeah. What does that mean? All players are like, like, at the matches, they don't sell burger meat, they sell like. Oh. You want to see the players switch all that. It's like quick Pritchard's in there. Eco, sort of like friendly stuff. We're onto their back line as well. That's exactly what I think Alex Neal's interesting uh, niche to go for. The Sunderland fans that don't like burgers. The Sunderland fans, the football fans that don't Just like burgers. Vic, Vito, there. welcome yeah, along. Close. Hello. Still have chips then, at least, which is good. Vito. Oh, oh, this one's too one good. One. This one's too good. Ellis is not as dim as his Sims. <laughs> <laughs> That's a joke. Well, you would come up with it's going to look any positive. Any positive out of that? We're, we're not losing, are we? So. No. We're not losing. I think. I don't know. We just keep running into pressure that we don't need to. Fulham have just scored as well. I think. Fulham. Do you know. Uh, I do think we'll. I do think we'll settle because we're not. We're not going to be absolutely first class for ninety minutes. Our. I mean, th there will be spells. Well, we haven't been first class for spells. the first twenty minutes, mate. So, yeah, we can do it. For, we can do it for seventy. Surely. <laughs> we literally haven't had a shot. It's twenty minutes in. And, uh, Fulham two 0 at home against Brentford. Ball, what was that pass? Lost you, but well, that was an absolute useless ball, ball, wasn't it? Kick. What was that pass? It's just that decision, um, isn't it? I'm out of it. Nice. How can a professional footballer make a pass that so far out? Big switch gets it wrong. This is the one, isn't it? Tell him pass that. He should have shot. Sim should have shot there. I think he hooped it and yeah, didn't work. So what's the lineup? The lineup is Patterson in goal, Serkin, Bath, and O9 at the back. You've got Clark on the left, Matete and Embleton as holding. Then um, on the right is Gooch, uh, Richard in Cam, and Sims and Stewart up front. I think I got that right. <laughs> two one at Black Blackpool, but at Turf Moor, so Burnley two, Blackpool one. Oh, Peterborough one, Lincoln nil. They're all coming in now. The action's happening up and down the league. I like to see it. I like to see it. Yeah, Fulham a two nil up as well. At um, against Brentford, so... Mm -hmm. 
That's crazy football, football in Brentford. Hammer Man United falling out. Uh, do you know what I find funnier about it though? Is is the Christian Eriksen side of it? He went from Brentford to Man United because Man United saw him as like a he's oh, totally. he's much better than this Brentford really club, and then he just get absolutely like slapped. Um, no damage. Yeah, they they cheated the, the cheat him off ironically when he went off for a sub or went to full time. It was quite funny. Uh, fair play to Brentford though for giving Eriksen like that reroute back into Premier League football. Because that's what he need. Like clubs weren't confident enough that post his um, the heart attack incident, he he, he wasn't fit for. Um, he was well left to right, see. Fit for the game so still. Not very old, like, is he, a couple of times the ball's been struck. Not very old. Travel, he's the same age as me, mate. Like, like he's a month uh, younger degrees. than me. I remember watching that incident. Be, uh, I was in the caravan live. Now, oh, I, I was used to be fucking distraught by that. I was like, why the fuck have the baby? He just come in through them, howling it. It's happened a few times, hasn't it, with players having heart uh, attacks like um, Fabrice Mwamba? It was like, because they get zoomed in. Well, uh, yeah, and they didn't, they didn't take the, the cameras off. Like, the BBC have the opportunity to move well, away the from the broadcasting. It's switched 1-0 oh, yeah. up against Shrewsbury at the New Meadow Stadium. Uh, Ips, which one will up? Yeah, the BBC could have cut yeah, them onto the studio, the couldn't they? Mm hmm. Good. Yeah. Poking it forward, looking. They don't have to use the footage. Ellis Sims. He's inside the area They're now. Sims win strikes. Sims for oh. the side netting. Yeah. Angle goes against him. He's asking for a corner. Feels that the keeper's made a save. Let's have a look back at it now. See, this is where VAR would come in useful. I know it's not a thing. The keeper doesn't touch that, mate. Looking at the goalkeeper. Yeah, I think Ipswich might win the. They could win the league in League One, couldn't they? They might. It's not the best team. Ipswich, mate. Wide. They, they were a weird team last season, season, weren't they? They, they didn't Gentlemen, that perform for the first. Be in their as well. um, yeah, it, be, yeah. it wasn't a corner, mate. It doesn't even touch the keeper. They've always bottled it in League One ever since. They've always been bottling it in League One. Well, they started the season so poorly last year. If they started their season Those in uh, so mid-November, so they yeah, would have been like, um, no. pretty much promoted. It's, it's, it's kind of bizarre. Or... Nah. See Linden there, looks I mean, in their first the season, 2019-2020, they started off there, well, Elliot but then they went it up on the edge of the box and down the, the toilet. Take it off him. They sort of tackled each other. It's just those little, little ones at this this minute that aren't going for us. Nice. Yeah, and Wickham are struggling, I think, aren't they? In league, one have not done great at the minute. Oh, great strength from Stewart. To get the ball back. Up to Pritchard. Pritchard fumbles the first ball and uh, gets it back. Ollie Johnston, welcome. Anyone got a link for the match? It's on SFC, the, uh, SFC's website. You have to just be on a VPN. They don't do dodgy links. Oh, well, I don't do dodgy links and I don't give them out. <laughs> don't want to risk it. <laughs> Dorking to Gates head now. Oh. <laughs> no, mate, sorry. Emble's Back in a second, guys, I'll do No worries, mate. Still coming forward as well. Yeah, what's your um, thoughts of the game so far, then? All right, I mean, what one, good two great start, but I think we're starting to well. wake up a bit now and wins a corner for Sunderland. Yeah, start attacking them now. Maybe a little so, bit more height on the cross, yeah. but you think we're slowly we're building into this, area then? Behind oh, yeah. for the yeah. corner. Yeah. I think that's typical Sunderland, really, isn't it? We sometimes do that. Positives from yeah. Linden Gooch's game. Our yeah. best yeah. potential effort the was Alan Gooch, Villa get 1. Man and put that ball in nice and early. Uh, Embo yeah, with a, the it, corner. Home, uh, we'll see if this goes in or not. In. Thank you for the, the 11 likes. I appreciate it. We've hit double digits, so there's my <laughs> target for the entire yeah, yeah. stream got done. Thank you very much. Legends. Yeah. Right, Palace 2, Villa 1. At the minute. Maybe take them. So with that, mate, use a VPN. Use a VPN. <laughs> I'm in Belgium right now. Okay. Called there from Embleton as he delivers towards the front post. It might bring Oh, this allows. I wasn't too sure that wasn't a uh, uh, hand involved in that. Yeah, Palace have had a goal disallowed. So. Flick. Palace have had a goal disallowed. Yeah, he said there was two one, but that's a one one. Yeah, Stoker having a bit of a wobbler now, by the way. It's still in play um, at the moment. Now it goes out. It's a bit fun. It's a bit of a weird one. So, 
you can buy a season pass for SAFC TV for 140 quid, so you can watch all the matches that are not on Sky. Um, or you can pay £10 per game. And now I'm thinking about it, I think I should just pay the, 10, the 140 quid. I know it's a lot of money, but... I just, I, I just go, I go up to Sunderland and ask Dreyfus to borrow some of his money, and I can use that. <laughs> um, I don't mind. I just want to know how to get to watch it. Uh, yeah, VPN, um, and log into SFC TV, and then yeah, you can watch the game. There's a goal at Gresty Road. Crew won Northampton nil in League Two. Again, oh, crew season last season, man. What, what were they doing? Circuit. Fell asleep off Dread, through I didn't like manager. I didn't like David Artel. I thought he were a bit. He's just he's arrogant. Finds Pritchard with a little really space as like well. Trying to work it wide. Sunderland on the attack. Eventually out of Gooch. Gooch. Gooch needs to do something Gooch. really good Inside here. Inside the area now. Linda make Gooch. something out of that. Oh, no. Charge down. Wins a corner. Go on. Last Ollie Johnson, come on, Stoke. <laughs> And to be fair, Stoke have had a really off. good opening 20 minutes Trying since the 20 minute mark. It's been on some of them. Smoggy's are losing to Reading. Smoggy's losing. losing. Yeah, I said that was going to be a 1 0. So get the shot away I'm, get, I'm getting some good, <laughs> some, good, um, some good predictions in now. I'm happy with this. Bally Mumble scored a second goal for Plymouth. Embleton, straight the keeper. keeper. Have a shot. Flip back in by Clark. Comes all the way through from Matete. Ah, oh, Matete with this well, weird scuff. Upwards. He's not scored yet. Matete. I'd like to see him score a goal. goal. I, I think, I don't know. He got, he got a little bit too much underneath the ball on that one. That sounds really bizarre because you say get well underneath the ball. But pretty much kicks the bottom of the ball and it goes sky high. Header on top of it, but, but it's not giving me that option. I want to watch the match Wednesday. The ball, flies it high, over the crossbar. Yeah, Bally Mumba scored a goal today for Plymouth. Match Wednesday. 2 0 for Plymouth at Forest Green and Peterborough 2 0 up against Lincoln. Nice, mate. Uh, so we've got a lot of action in the other leagues, not not that much in, in this one. There's been. Or collectively four goals so far. One for Reading and three in the Burnley match, and that's it. I know in the one yeah. in the Luton match, so there's been five goals across the uh, championship so far. Half an hour into the games. Great. Welcome back, DJ. Hello, as back. Just, just Hello, saying. Um, that's um. Puts him right into the middle. Yeah, it's chilling out. Oh, Patterson so again with the. There. Great clear. I thought that went in. I thought the score then scored. Stoke left hand side. Threatening it quite a lot. Spot comes in there. Who's number? Who's that? Number six. What have I missed much? Drops down. Um, Stoke had an opportunity, didn't they? They nearly. Pretty much, mate. I was saying. Um, I was saying just a couple of seconds ago. Basically, it's not been all Stoke for the first twenty minutes, and then some. Middles Brunel. Getting into it. Plymouth for winning as well. Bally Mumba got their second goal. We're through for a shot at the far post. In the good. Oh. down. <laughs> oh, nine's a fucking Danny hero. Jesus. Did you see that? Still up into the air. Oh, thank you for the subs as well, guys. That's players. awesome. Please at high. And the Sims trying to get underneath um, it. Oh, MK Don's won Atkinson nil. Then goes down. The MK Stadium. Comes back with it. What? Delap turns, goes down, gets back up, goes down again. What's happening? Ball's still in play. Yeah, so everyone seemed to stop there, penalty, yeah. Wasn't he? So Matesi comes in with the challenge from behind. That was bizarre. He feels he's got a little nudge in his back. It was really bizarre. Down. Refs waved it away. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. UK Dons. It's when and and all all the Sims down. down. Trying to hold it off as he caught him with an arm. We'll have to see this is a weird, play, this is a sure. really weird game so far. Um, Kilkenny, who's gone down. Do you know the last time when Sunderland played Stoke? Let's just have a look at this one back now. Spence. Twenty we'll January 2017, wasn't it? The yeah, we haven't played them in five years. It is a strange yeah, it's not a lot, and you can't well, see anything too obvious there. It's pretty much all Stoke, but I can see Sunderland snatching something from this. Um, it, I don't think I'm we've not, deserved to be in the lead. I'm, not worried, at, I'm oh. not worried at all because I mean the amount of times it's been all Sunderland. United. Blood from the nose or. The face certainly. Sheffield United are in front against Blackburn. 
Oh, okay. Instructions from Alex Neal just gets organized a little bit. I don't know. I thought they were riding really high after their first three games, but if they continue continue this form, it, it just proves that they were that bit lucky <laughs> in their opening couple of games. Um, Defensively, everything. Yeah. I think. I think this league is so tight. Like no team is really dominating. Like the. There's nobody like standing out as like the best team in the league right now. Which I think is a really good sign for how close and competitive it can be. Pompey winning one nil against Bristol Rovers. Oh. Look at them from both sides of it. Is it? Flailing arm, as they say, and it's of course. Who's Bristol Rovers, Rovers, Rovers playing? Sorry, trying to back in and hold the player off. Portsmouth at Fratton Park. Got oh, yeah. Oh, it's one. League, league yeah, One, yeah. Sorry, I was like, I haven't done the prediction for that one. Can it stand Portsmouth? Ellison's running away from him. Oh, them fans that attacked Luke O'Neill. Oh, it was one fan, wasn't it? And he got he got jail time for it. The fucking pleb. <laughs> <laughs> He looks like oh. that guy for uh, Gremlins. You know that guy who says, "Hey, you guys." He looks like um, the Goonies. Oh, the Goonies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the Gremlins. I, I think actually, Anth, Anth looks a bit like Not Smith, them, doesn't he, on certain angles? Goonies, do you think? Yeah. Uh, what? I look like who? <laughs> sloth. Sloth. Yeah. Oh God, who's fucking sloth? <laughs> it's not a good <laughs> nickname. I can tell you that much. I don't. Absolutely brilliant. There you go. Oh, three one Burnley. Can he wants to? I'm um, getting there with the goal. Yeah, the right you need it to be 5 1 now, mate. Today. Dwight Gale there alongside <laughs> to get two off. points. <laughs> sure we'll see him at some stage in the game. If oh, it goes 3 2, I get two the points. Top two, it's either, the top two is either going to be Burnley, Norwich, or. Um, with there, just... the blood shirt coming up. Watford, I'd say. The teams that came down last season, yeah. you're thinking they're, they're going to be in an automatics to go back up. They do. No, it's definitely. You go. Oh my god. That's a lot of blood. <laughs> got a tampon up his nose. <laughs> he's, got he's got his nose busted. <laughs> you, you oh think my I'm god, he has. He's pulled a tampon up. Oh, oh, tampon there's up been a nose. goal at um, Loftus big, Road. Yeah. There's been a goal at Loftus Road. Oh, okay. Go for it. Half a Who's it going for? Yeah, nil. Rotherham won. Nice. Cow will be yeah, happy with that. Rotherham like on there. The, the, back to the studio. This one out there, isn't back it? To the studio. Rather than back to the studio, where I'm tied down his neighbour's curtains. No, it's you that tied down your neighbour's curtains. I don't. No my neighbours that No, DJ, DJ sniffs his grandma's knickers. Sniffs his nana's knickers. With his pogs, with two pigs trotters in his hands as well. Probably be about five minutes added on for this. Oh, yeah. This is a. This is going to be at least a four-minute add-on of extra time. He's not stopped not leaning from his nose. Worry about but... the pegs, yeah, yeah, they're down to ten men here. We need to capitalize on this as quickly as possible. There's just, not, there's there's just nothing happening, is there? Half time, ten minutes or so. It's like watching Newcastle. I don't know. Nothing change. Stuck down to ten men for now. Uh, you you know, Newcastle. That reminds me. My fucking toilet got blocked this morning. I'll have to try and get that fixed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what was it? The shit that it reminded you of? Is that what? Is that what it was? Uh, um, take advantage of this. Yeah. Well, it was a stench. Our last had a shite before. <laughs> it's just like a tiny rod every time she goes in the toilet. You really don't want to know. Want to Might know. have had a tick. <laughs> 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 um, yeah. Um, go on then. Summary, DJ. What what are you seeing so far? You're <laughs> happy with this half? Still nil nil. Look, I'm not, I'm not disappointed, put it this way. I mean, it's nil-nil. We've not let a goal in. I mean, mm -hmm. we've got plenty of time to come into the game. Um, it's, it's, been, it's been a scrappy affair. I mean, they've had more mm -hmm. open, Oops. more chances. Oh, offside. Um, we, we don't seem to be knitting at the minute like we did at Sheffield United. Just, like, it just seems so disjointed. I don't know whether because Stoke are closing so much. I just don't yeah. know what it is. It's just, it's, it's hard to watch. There's been a goal at Bolton, hard University of Bolton. Oh, okay. Go for it, mate. Uh, Who's Bolton winning? Nil, Sheffield Wednesday won. Wednesday are winning away at Bolton. I can see Wednesday coming up this season as well. 
Nah, I think they'll be in playoffs. I think it's Sheffield Check Wednesday versus Wickham in the really 2023 really League One playoffs. Well, basically the same as what it was last season, but without us there. <laughs> yeah, Wickham might start having Wembley heartbreak. Like we have. Mm. Mate, that, you do know they only come to you if you've got a search history with like certain words in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's your own fault. If you're getting Viagra, if you're getting Viagra advert, it's your fault, buddy. <laughs> They need to sort that stuff out, don't they? When you get them spam accounts following you, but you, you can't them. you can't get away from it though. Instagram everywhere you go. Tete. Oh, West Brom are winning against Hull at the half on stadium. Oh nine up against Delap again. Delap approaching with speed. Is that not outside. a fell ref? Shoves Hugo nine out the way. Yeah, Twitter, Instagram, you get all them accounts. It's like go away. I block him as well. Again, block him, report him. The last, the last so picture versus on, nine. Picture on Twitter, John O'Shea sitting in the Stoke City dugout. John O'Shea. Yeah. Mate, how is that not a foul? He doesn't go for the ball and he just goes for the man. That is a fucking foul. Towards the end, he were rubbish, John O'Shea, but a bit before he were good. But his last you know, season and a half. Yeah. Yeah. He what? But not attitude-wise, and he, 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 he did he was good. Yeah, I just oh, think his legs went a bit too. Man United defender for years for no reason, Kenny. was he? Exactly. I, I think his legs just got like a age thing, thing, isn't it? And just go. Small Full goal. On goal. Oh, does that count Foster's as a 1-0 hole then? <laughs> for another corner, their fifth of the game. Well, Wednesday a 2-0 look now. At ball in that second phase, isn't it? Ross wins the first one again. So, are we above sure Stoke in the table? In. Yes, we are. We're 12, yeah. they're 16. Stoke, we're 18. Jack Clark. Well, yeah, because they were. Yeah, still great team last time. Smashes yeah, clear. I'm looking at the live standing. So Swansea have dropped two places, and uh, Bristol City have dropped because they're not playing till yeah. tomorrow. So yeah, they've dropped. What do you think we need to change at half time, then, lads? What do you, do you think? There's any changes needed, or what? Uh, yeah. So if we change into our red and white kit, I think that might be better for us because uh, the red and white team are dominating today. <laughs> Put Bailey right on, then we can have a solid Thompson. defence, can't we? But that's I've, probably not going to happen. Yeah, I agree with that, uh, Jake. But wow. Luko Nine's been bullied. He's been absolutely. <laughs> he's been made to look really Get amateurish, get, like especially against the last. Stands one up towards the back post. He's turned into a bully now. He's been nice little boy, didn't he, in Stoke. League One? But now look at him now. He's a bully. Who, Liam? Oh, Luko Nine. Yeah. I mean, we needed that. Luke we needed that well the shift yeah, away from Clark, being the nice guys. Well, Wickham are one nil up at Oak Well Stadium. And your number ten in the left back and position. Barnes. As that ball comes in, Luke does the right thing. Oh. Turns it behind for the corner. Uh, where are we at? I think there's basically three games now without a goal in the championship. The uh, Watford game, our game, and the Preston game. No, it's Birmingham. Yeah, yeah. Winning. Where Birmingham? Where Birmingham? Birmingham, I think, was can't keep hold of the against Wigan. Yeah, 14. Yeah, up. A little bit loose on his touch. Yeah. Just the ball back to Stoke. Oof. Newport 2, Tramia Rovers 1. And, two. and goes off the Stoke player last. Go the goal kick. Jack Clark just gets back at post, doesn't he? I think the linesman was sure at first whether to, to give the corner. Man, what is it? You see it? What are they doing with this? The time taken to get the ball to the line there asking. It's a corner. <laughs> Gary Bennett needs to chill out a little bit, but I think. I, I don't know, mate. Uh, there has been a very whimpering uh, first half. Sunderland have had two shots all half, both of them off target, to Stoke seven. Yeah, it's pretty much all Stoke. We're, really we're, we're not losing. Here. We've got, we've got, we've got the second half there, to come out. Stoke won't keep that up all game. Nine, so no, no. That, they'll drop off all Stoke. They'll you be shattered. They won't keep that up all game. I think it's well, pretty much impossible for them to keep all game. You know how many times has Sunderland come out like Stoke? Elliot Embleton with the clip that time. How many times have we come out like Stoke the first half and then the second the second half have been totally shit? Yeah, QPR. So that's an example. Deal says, uh, "Hello, fellow tie-dying champions." 
third one in the book. <laughs> third booking of the game. Third booking for right. Sunderland. We've got three booking for Sunderland. Tie Dye United. Tie Dye FC. Two centre midfielders straight away. Tie Dye United. Three or four C there. Tie Dye Albion. How many more can we go for? Tie Dye Argyle. Tie Dye Rovers. Maybe not. No, it's a cheap one, isn't it? Tie Dye Associated Football Club. Uh, if we go if we go into the European market, tie dye club do football. Paper, isn't it? Thompson over the ball. <laughs> Probably yeah, it does uh, I'll stop now, right I'll foot. stop. Football the tie dye. Uh yeah. One so, from this kind of distance, once this free kick's done and dusted, toes. I'll um I'll bring up uh, Niles point off, and get your off. opinions on it. Oh, still have oh, a free kick on the uh, right. the twenty five yard line. We're experts at getting boot oh, like wide. wide. Yeah, but that was better because it didn't end up in a in a fucking goal like it did last week. Was it troubled by um, it? Yes. Yeah, so now Could says Kieran Richardson free kick. Could have been like Kieran Richardson free yeah, kick against the man. Yeah. Boom. Uh, the cooks it, doesn't he? Boom. Top corner. Yeah. Thank you very much. I don't. I don't think. The way he was lining up, that was ever going to happen. So, Niall says, yet another commentary game postponed. They should really be punished. And um, I, I, I agree with that. But what are your thoughts? Yeah, I think... It's not fair, is it, on other clubs? Yeah, it's, yeah. Re it's really not. you got to think, Huddersfield now are in the bottom four, One, bottom three... Yeah. Because, no, they're in the bottom three now because they didn't get the chance to play Coventry. And when you when you get a bottom three status on your team, um, that that basically makes the other team more confident that they're going to beat you. So, like, I know it doesn't mean you're going to lose or win every game, but it does have an impact. Um, and it's harder to climb out of the bottom three once you're in it. So yeah, absolutely agree. Cov should be punished, but you can't. I don't blame the Cov fans. I, blame the cops no, it's... org like the ownership they they fucked that up massively they knew that this stadium would be used in the commonwealth games but yet they didn't do anything to make sure that the earth was ready mad well, we would get penalized if it was us yeah but it's uh, how long does that decision take uh, Carl Francis says, "How's you three sexy bastards doing?" <laughs> um, we were playing, just having it uh, in the cave. So, thank you. We'll have a couple of minutes on as well for that. all right. Thank you for the compliment. Lot of sun and lot of sun and fans are. Um, lot of sun and fans say, like you know, what was it? Was sun and getting bootings constantly? It's like what's going on? No score yet between Stoke City and Sunderland. Yeah. Oh, 1-1 one, one already. Okay, the level of back yeah, in that one. Nice. Peterborough 3-0 up and Fulham 2-1. So, what was the um the early Premier League result? What do you think what do you think's missing, lad? What do you think's missing? In quality today. From the team, what, 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 today, it's, today, it's, today it's passing quality. Yeah. I think. Missing, I we don't need any changes, do you think? Yeah, say Anthony's saying passing quality. Bench, so that's to me suggests um, he's not match fit. The only the only efforts that we seem to be getting are from like long balls like that, um, and it's kind of half chances at best from it as well. It's not there's no precision to it. It is just like let's. Who's fit and go yeah, forward? Exactly that, on, First one, one nil. Well, Thank you for uh, uh, confirming, yeah, Super. That's, that's what we're going to win in one nil as well. Need some t-shirts. Need some t-shirts this time next year. You'll be one fucking man. Oh, I die t-shirt. Do you know the do you know the Macam bit here? I got that put on a water bottle. Two seconds. I'm going to get a great deal in that, but we kick against Sunderland. Oh, that's. Hello. So here you go. Here's my Macam water bottle. It looks like the Marvel logo, you know, Marvel. Yeah, looks like that sort of logo. It was inspired by it. <laughs> you can't say you copy stuff because then that gets you uh, open to it. Goals. Get the wig out. On Get the wig on for look. So I only wear the wig when we're winning. So it's here. We've got it ready. You want to wear the wig? There you go. You can you can have the wig on. 
Uh, Roberts. Oh, um, DLC and put Roberts on. Is that a good shout? Just heavy on Who would you put Roberts on Jack for? Clark. Clark. Get in there. Clark goes inside. Keeps a hold of for a second. <laughs> yes, I will. Ross Stewart. Oh, go on, Stewart. Ross Stewart on. takes it down. Have a shot. Shoots. On target. It's a goal. It's a goal. Yes. It's a goal. Yes. 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 Ross Stewart has scored. And that looks simple. What? Well, it did, yeah. The captain takes his dress. Get it in! Get it Half time, well, if he even did enough, it stays like this. <laughs> oh, where on the, the counter attack, Jack, Jack Clark, isn't it? Down in that left back position, does really well. Wins the ball back, could have just dropped what it off, but he doesn't. He turns with it, gets his head up, and drops a lovely ball over Long the top ball, there. Nice the one. Stuart in between the centre half. With one but across, it looks like the angle's getting away from it. Keeper, I don't think he'll be happy when he sees it back. You know, it's a difficult, it's a tight right, angle, isn't it? Not. Ross, it's getting away what from What do we need to go do now? The <laughs> <He> does. <laughs> Two touches from Ross Stewart. Gets it out from under his feet. Yeah. Plays it across the goalkeeper. I do, do not, not want a first half mirror. mirror. Jack Clark picked yeah. it up, went inside. Just just which team one over the top. are Burnley playing today? Like you say, I think the keeper's going to be disappointed. Stronger wrists on the ball than that. But it wasn't the centre half of Jack Yard. It wasn't the centre half of Jack Yard. It wasn't the centre half of Jack Yard. It wasn't the centre Ben Wilmot. Yeah, back in, yeah, Wilmot and Thompson oh, there. Burnley are playing... That's what you want there. Sims and, Blackpool. and Ross Blackpool, there pulling yeah. on the shoulder, getting yeah. in between the lines, and between um, the centre-half and the, and the wing-back. I said Hull should Not be winning 4-0, but I did change it from West Brom so winning. Ross so keeper, kind of... disappointed, as we say, the goalkeeper, <laughs> but coming up to half-time... Through we'll Alexander a 2-1 up at yeah, half-time against Northampton. I'm just going to keep the ball on there for fucking ears. It's super up the row. recent games, they have been... Rest and nil. Showing signs of discontent, which will... Any good there. Favor, now let's park the bus the rest of our and time. rest on the level. Oh no, have so we not fucking learned? Have we not learned? Sat back. Sitting back. Just then. We can't be park the bus. We can't. No. Have you seen somebody who's got Loch Ness drug for tattooed on their thigh? That is so dumb. And, yeah. Well, and, is there a way to stop the stream so I, so I can say it's really. I don't know what's up with that. You'd, you'd have to start a new one. Why it's having it's really. A sucker punch for that. You'd have to start a new one, yeah. If you think starting a new. Just put like. Just, just do. Um, at half time, end your stream and just put like second half on your new one. And you can start the new one for the second half. So if you need to, turn it off and turn it on again. All good. So, Sunderland in the lead. Uh, I don't think we've deserved to be in the lead, if I'm being time. honest. Um, but nah, I'm not going to I'm not going to complain. No. Um, the ping ball works occasionally, and no, absolutely not. Uh, yeah, I think that'll that'll bring us more confidence in the second half. Just say, let's just get over the top of them. They're, they're clearly slower than our strikers. It's all it's all about putting the ball in the net, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And that's half time. No, Bill, no, that's a great part of the game. How long before he takes Sims off? I don't think he's going to change the um, striking part of it. Half time. Right, I'm going to be in the United one. Half time. In injury time. Half time at the Britannia. I'm going to turn down the audio from the coverage. Um, uh, make sure I've got you two back on the full screen. Now, let's go, wheel lads. But yeah, um, half time, uh, 1 0 up with our only shot on target. To be honest, the game has been pretty much stoke all the way, so. I'd be more pissed off if I was a Stoke fan than um, Sunderland being happy, if that makes sense. Um, if you're dominating a game like that, it's disappointing not to go, um, not not to go in like at least. And I've level. just I've just stopped my stream. Do I need to yeah. turn off Google Meet as well? No, 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 no. Yeah. No. No, you don't need to turn off Google Meet. Just create a new broadcast and call it second half and go from there. Um, so yeah, uh, yeah, Super Rock Road, the goals do change games. Um, you can hide my stream, so you can hide my, um, my coverage that you can see, so you can, like, turn off one individual thing. 1-0 Charlton, apparently, is that right? Yeah, at the Valley, yeah, against Cambridge, at the Valley. I think, yeah, that's the stadium, isn't it? Valley, Charlton. The Valley. So, um, a win 
by the way, if we if we maintain this score line, a win would take us into sixth place currently. With um, basically, that's I think that's as high as we could get unless it's a goal difference. With Burnley being one goal difference better off than us, so um, oh, unless any of the teams Reading, Burnley, or Watford drop points, um, we're stuck at sixth. The end of this end of the game. All right, Peterborough three 0 up. Yeah, three 0 yeah. Peterborough. Right, so Jacob, uh, yeah, do you want to do your quick summary of the of the first half? Do you have misrepresented our our game so far? No, nah, I think you summed it up. Stuck with a better team, but we started in later on in the game. We started throwing the kitchen sink at them then we started waking up and taking our chances and towards the end of the first half we took it and we got what we got we uh, I think we've uh, I think we've got a lucky a lucky break on and I'm I'm fine with having <coughs> lucky breaks every now and again it's it's not the end of the world you don't have to play every mm. game super pretty for the entire 90 um DJ I, what I, I know you're doing some to fix your technical issues, but uh, do you want to give your half time summary up as well? Yeah, I mean, I've been to many Sunderland games, watched many Sunderland matches where um, we've been absolutely all over a decent side, um, but we haven't scored and they've gone up and had the chance and scored. And oh, that, that that resembles, honestly, it's, I know it sounds tough, but that resembles a good side. Um, that the fact that you, you need it, you just need that chance that open and bang and put the ball in the net and. Um, you can't complain with that. I'll take that all day long. Um, I just want to yeah. see us a bit more confidence in the yeah. second half. Um, go for the jugular and um, show us... Sh look, we've got the head start now. You know, There's no excuse now. Go out there, kill them off. Show what we can do. Yeah. Yeah, just finish them off. Mortal Kombat style. Man, have you seen this? Uh, uh, do you know the, the footage here that you're using at half-time? They've put a big, big logo on it, but I think they've used footage from my video. You know, what my, I can do, see on do, my end was a bit of the playoff final. Yeah, so they they used the fans in the street, then they used the fans um, at Trafalgar, then this the 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 game itself. I like, but it wasn't like the TV recording of the game. It was the fans' footage, but I'm pretty sure I edit <laughs> those clips. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, like in my um, we are Sunderland video, of, like that. Yeah, that's bizarre. Still reminiscing about that win against Wickham. Mate, oh. it was what a what a day, what a fucking day. Um, and I kind of wanted it to be Wickham because I've never liked Wickham in League One. I, ever since when we drew in the first season of League One, and there was a fight between one of our players and Wickham, I just couldn't stand Wickham. It's one of those teams that you hate. I've just done another broadcast, um, but I think yeah. I think the problem is is because of the fact because I've got Google Meet open. It's really fucking up the bandwidth. Um, I don't know why the internet is that slow today. The weather's atrocious. We had the weather, whether that's doing it, but it's really playing havoc with everything. So the only thing I can do is shut Google Meet down and stop having that video playing, and um, everything will come clear. No, no, mate, that just won't work. Um, what you can do on Google Meet is essentially stop video if you click on the three dots and just have it as uh, audio only. You'll be fine. I don't know you can do that, yeah. Yeah. You just put it to audio only mode. You don't have the video footage, you don't have that bandwidth being took up. Um but yeah, well good. Um, have you stopped the video, do you know? Press the three dots. I think so. But um Yeah, Sun and one nil up. Um I I'm 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 kinda of really relieved more than anything, because I like I said for the game, Sunderland are clinical up front. I think all we need is that one or two chances, like clear breakthrough chances, and and we're getting the we're getting the goals. Stewart and Sims, all they need is a good clean line of line of goal, and and they've got it. They've got it in the back of the net. It's where I'm worried going into the second half is our strength in back, back three. Um, Luke on nine was very. Soft in the first 10 15 minutes, and then he, he decided to book up his book up his ideas a little bit and end up getting a yellow card as well. Um, 
yeah I, I don't know i think this is the one game i'm actually kind of thinking luke 09 needs to be subbed off even if he is putting in all of his effort um i think he'll just he'll end up with a red if he if we're not careful well he's um well he's uh what DJ, you started a sentence there, mate, and then didn't finish it. <laughs> I think he's in a talking to some secret friends who may maybe wanted to tie down some curtains. Curtain FC, um, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know. What, what do you reckon? Uh, what you should be doing going into the second half? Obviously, Alex Neil does what Alex Neil wants. But what would if you were in the you you were the gaffer in the in the in there? What are you looking at changing? What are you looking at solidifying? I'd sort out maybe try and sort out the defense mm-hmm. around there, and I'd be telling them do not sit back. I'd be going out. I mean, changing rooms like Peter Reid. You know, hmm. do you think having that, three at the back is detrimental to us or not? Um, I think, yeah, I think we need the three at the back. Yeah. So I just hope we put Bailey right on, but it's probably not going to happen. All right, I'm. Uh, I'm just going to pause the the SFC coverage just to go over the half time scores. Um, is there any of these scores that are, are shouting out to you as being like wildly like the wrong way around or uh, disappointing? So Birmingham Wigan a nil nil, Burnley a three one up at uh, against Blackpool, oh Huddersfield postponed, Preston North End Watford is still nil nil, uh, QPR against Rotherham is a one one um, half time score, Rod uh, Rodding, Reading against Middlesbrough that's a one nil lead for the home team. Same with Sheffield and Blackburn. Uh, Luton are 1 0 up away from home at Swansea, and West Bromwich Albion are 1 0 up against Hull City. So, not bad uh, results. They're not bad results. Um, is any of them that is surprising you, though? I'd actually say Reading and Middlesbrough is quite surprising. I'd expect Middlesbrough to be, be like a 3 1 win for Borough or a 3 0 win, but. You've still got the second half for that. Um, yeah, I could come back and bite Redding. Bite Redding in the in the butt if they don't take a second goal. Yeah, mm-hmm. Karma. What about you, DJ, mate? I think you're still on mute. Yeah, that's fine. So I'm just... Um... I can hear us now. Yeah, I can hear you. Yes. Yeah, I was just recording. I was just recording the, the highlights so I can put on YouTube with me voicing yeah. over, um, you know, giving a bit of commentary as they're going in, so I can, yeah, do my videos. Right. So I I asked, what is any of the halftime results surprising you at the minute? Jacob said Reading um, being up. To be honest with you, I wasn't. I wasn't. I, I wasn't really paying attention because I was uh, sorting out the um, videos. I figured. I figured. Um, the one result that is surprising me, though, is West Brom being ahead at Hull. Um, yeah, that. I, I don't know why, um, but I'm not expecting much from West Brom under Steve Bruce anymore. Um, I thought he, he lost looks like not a face like a pie face, isn't he, or cabbage, or <laughs> Bruce, isn't he? he looks like he's been on the sunbeds too often in his youth, and it's affected his. Uh, his... He's been cooked a couple of times. Um, but yeah, I, I genuinely thought um, going into this game, he's lost the confidence in his team. Um, and that's quite a bad bad thing to be as when you're a manager. If you lose your confidence, you, you, you're soon not longed for the job. Um, yeah, there's that. Remember when we were with Steve Bruce? We had Darren Bent, Bolo Zenden, Titus Bramble, all those... We go from players such as them to now. It's just yeah. sad how we've gone fold apart. But now we're on the way back. We're, I think we'll. I, I, and that should be all right doing that. that video, shouldn't I? Just put my voice over it. Uh, you should be, yeah. 
I've just recorded the little highlights off off the telly, um, and it's just been talking about it. It should be all right. Yeah, it should be fine. Um, Renan, welcome along from uh, Palmas, Brazil. Pal- Pal- Ooh, I can't Brazil. say that very well. <laughs> Palmeiras. Palmeiras. My bad for the pronunciation. But um, yeah, welcome along from Brazil. Do you think Tie Dyes Rovers AFC will make the top four this year? Who's <laughs> seeing that? Carl. If they put their mind to it and they don't do <laughs> what Sunderland and sit back. <laughs> I think so. I think they're going to be destined for the Champions League final. You, <laughs> uh, Cal, um, from a Rob. Would be the tie dyeing in neighbours' curtains this end. Yeah. Pissing down. <laughs> you can still tie dye it in your bath. Um, but anyways, I'm asking Cal from a Rob Run perspective. Going one 0 up to them being back level at one one before the half time <laughs> whistle blows. <laughs> Are you disappointed or are you actually okay with it and just thinking that the second 45 is what matters? So it's just, yeah. And same with Sunderland, to be fair. You think you think we go into this half thinking, right, it's actually nil nil. It's not nil nil, but do you think they should be going in with that mentality to try and get a second goal? Yeah, definitely to put it to bed, like at least be get two more goals maybe or something like that. Two more goals. Well, we, well yeah, I agree. Because last time we were two two goals up to the good, we ended up uh, getting a point. So, yeah. Three nil. Want it to be three nil. Get at least three goals, and then. Uh, that's a good question. No. By the way, that's a good question. Do you want to do you wanna answer that one? Do you think they'll do a sun until I die part three? I'd like to. They could have done it in last season because apparently there were. Doing, they had the cameras behind the scenes last season, but it'd be good. I think everybody in their in their horsemen are doing these documentaries on football teams now because Welcome how successful I think the Chelsea one was. Um, Man U TV. I think people realise there's a lot of interest in how the professional football game is played, and especially at multiple levels. When it's Arsenal, who cares? <laughs> I know other than Arsenal fans, genuinely, who's caring about the Arsenal show? Because it's the same thing. Yeah, just discussing ours there. We're, the same thing. There was some change, I think, about so worry now. some sort of documentary from, about a, from a red card. Obviously, you're two centre midfielders yeah, on Amazon. the yellows. And yeah, it's on Amazon, well. isn't it? The, the Arsenal F. The Arsenal F. Like, you know, this is their last the bench, season. The Pento, it, is, we're not sure what's kind of weird, with Corey. I think. Well, there he is. He's coming out now with the armband on. I think there should be 12 episodes of these, right? And it should be on so it's and it should but be yeah, month per month. We'll have like, like a, a December month, there, and then that comes out mid to January, and then they can. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think like an episode a month would be really cool to see because during the season, any changes that are made in the back or the front is is clear, and then the story and narratives not like driven by how shit we were or how good we were at the start. Straight swap for Corey Evans. Darren Gibson did miss time just before that as well, didn't he? Um, disappointed as we tend to get tired in the second well. half. Oh shit! It's a family affair. Yeah, really Fair enough. Yeah, Robin, 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 okay. Yes. Subs at half time. He's done something nice. smart here. Billy Wright and Corey Evans coming on. Who's off? A bit of a hard time of Liam Delap. Evans is so on Evans. for, captain now for yeah. Sunderland. Four nine, and Wright is on Bailey for. Wright has come on. We yeah, suspect so Bailey's like... come on for Luke. Luke, I think. Yeah, Actually, oh, Bailey, Bailey Wright. Well. Bailey Wright's on for Luke or nine. So well, who's? Then to put on your screen, but Evans... Yeah, we need it on the screen so I can see who's been subbed off for who. Is that a three-one lead for Burnley now? Is that, is that gone up? Was that what it was at half time? Hold on, nah. someone yeah. just knocking at me though. Hold on. And it's an interesting one because Corey completely missed out against Sheffield United. Ooh, good manager though, wasn't he? His name's Sean Dyke. Yeah, yeah, something wrong there. I think Two half time subs so though. That's, that's really refreshing to see that he's not, he's not just trying to like play out five, ten minutes and, and settle into the game. He's doing, doing things that were needed. Earlier, he's not done really that. For the start of the he won't do a Phil Parkinson where he'll leave it till the very last minute. So, as you say, he was. 
He has, he has had a couple of off. games where he's only made two subs, yeah, and then that's for the proper the fuck for us. Burton are one, uh, one nil down to Port Vale at the Pirelli <laughs> Stadium. <laughs> that's grim. It's a bit of a derby day, that, because Burton and Port Vale are not far from each other. Uh, I'm in the middle of both of them, mate. Um, continue. Moss Stewart still going. Ellis Sims ahead of him. Moss Stewart takes all the shots. Shot. Comes out of Jack Clark. Jack Clark. Oh, off the first defender. Cleared. Sunderland having a good Moss start to this half. Well, Markham are winning away at Oxford. Oh, no. Oh, Brentford and Fulham 2-2. Um, that's what I thought they might have done with the perfect ending to it last year. Oh, getting promoted. That would have been so good. West Gooch is uh, holding his back here. I'm not sure as to if he actually got injured. It's funny that when the referee I think I'll have to cancel my um, stream on YouTube. Injured, it's just not. Give a free kick but more than that, never done this before. It's strange. What do you think he's gone down? Mate, if you want at the end of this one, just free kick, but use mine. It feels like he's got his body in the match. Come through behind. I don't, I don't know why though. I'm, I've got I've got 36 download speed on the internet, and that's more than enough. And I just don't know why. See what happens when you bring on a young Aussie. Hopefully, <laughs> defensively, I think we'll be better off the middle, now gonna have because to... it's yeah. people yeah. dedicated in their oh, position. Oh, this is a card. Right, so the substitute oh. confirmation is Billy Wright is on for yeah. Lugo 9. The lap's getting the uh, yellow card. Shot, <laughs> yeah, and he's, he's and and pushing he likes Danny back. The, the jewels Late. as well, doesn't he? He, he left a few on Luko 9 in the first half. He's trying West to get him to but he becomes the first he's the second sub. into the book. These fucking graphics need to hurry up. I hate this. Shit, back on here, we already knew that one. From, it? Just runs into yeah, so Fulham to Brentford. Leaves a little bit in. Mm -hmm. And how is the uh, video showing up okay on yours, but not on my channel? I <laughs> honestly fun. don't know, mate. I, I don't know. What was Patterson's right pass there? there? It's a bit of a dive there, I think, from Jacob Brown. There's nothing much. Brentford have had a goal this so loud. So just need to tidy it up a bit, and then Patterson rolls. Is he? He's not right, getting right, fucking short. sent off for this. It's not a yellow card, is it? Oh, is what's it? Who's getting sent off? Oh, it's the yellow Gooch. card. What? Sometimes you can make and a with a Brazil the flag. Lights just, lights the just come on. Yeah, come in. I think referees don't like us in the NFL, especially. No, they don't like us. Jacob Brown made a lot of that. They're just against us. I just pull him. Back if anything, it's not a yellow card. It's a free kick, yes, but you don't have to book players for that. It's not going anywhere. And the other so Corey Evans is on for Matete. Matete is off. Clearing the book for Sunderland. His belly rises free head at the back post. Do you know what that all stemmed from? This entire like free kick yellow card. It all stemmed from fucking Anthony Patterson kicking it low and soft. Centre half up from the back. One of the Leicester are one nil up now. Rather than just doing what keepers do, two for out. Leicester are one nil up. Nice. Who scored? Goal in the week. I know Jack's not defending. Madison. But they do a job for your team. Madison. Afternoon time. Hello, hello. We seem to do a job for his team. So what would you if you were playing left centre half? There would be more chatting at the minute. I'm just sorting out all the shit here. I think I'll have to get a big. I think I'll have to get a big DSL cable so I can stop using the Wi-Fi extender. So I can just plug it in from the router. I do recommend having an Ethernet. There's a thing called a TP link. You know, a lot of people, as I say, will say... Oh, I'll have a crack on me later about it anyway, if I don't want to be you're back there, you know, yeah. you've got a you've got a man behind you. Uh, got just got a nice chat, uh, chat from... It won't let me select DJ uh, at Aces nice one there for some reason. Inside, just got and with the hair. Wait. Let me just... I don't to do that. What's BRFO? Brazil... I don't know what FO. Barrow Islands? The assist for the goal. Oh. It off there to Alex Pritchard. Ooh. Pritchard on the edge of the box. Digs one ah. out. Ah. Tries to hook it into the top corner. It just goes into the crowd. But, but, thank you for the 17 likes, by the way, everybody that's here. Yeah, um, it, it is a better start to this half as well. It's a much better start. Um, Peterborough 4 0 up now against Lincoln. 4 0 up. Christ almighty. Yeah. <laughs> a Lincoln Cannon fodder for the relegation this season or not? What was their home ground, Peterborough? I can't remember what it was. Is it London Road? Uh, a shithole? That's what, that's what it was. <laughs> Baker. Uh, it's just another 
Another League One stadium, isn't it? Yeah. Smashed us 3 0, didn't they, in our second Thompson. season in League One? And I think 09, was it 09 got sent off? Yeah. EBPR. Euro, Euro, UK flag, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Oof. Connor Taylor playing around Ross Stewart there. And we, uh, to go forward. Oh. There we go. Now drops it off to Fossey, who crosses it. Oh, there's a lot of these kind of efforts coming in from Stoke. It's it's whipped into it's the box and yeah, it's yeah, it's right, straight like to Stevens, one so player. <coughs> right but I think we're getting like enough bodies around that one player, so they their, their efforts very limited. What's your thoughts on the Stoke City kit? Martin, it looks uh, with them pattern. I love that. I think it's a really good kit. I like it. Like, Bailey does it look nice? Right the, the back three. I think what they've what oh, they've done as well. Like, when you go to the their shop so and want to buy it, you can buy it Delac. with or without the Bet Three Six Five uh, logo on it as well. As an adult, because normally you you you're forced to have the kit sponsor. If we don't like, I can't remember who our sponsor is now. Uh, if we don't like the Spreadex sponsor on our kit, we could buy it without it. Um, I like I kind of like that from from Thompson. Stoke. I think they've got people in Stoke that don't want to advertise a betting company. They don't have to. I I think that's a really classy touch. The trap to boys are two 0 up against Shrewsbury. Some of the reasonings why he's on the pitch anyway. Yeah. Back to Maurice. Bristol City or Bristol Rovers? Sorry, Rovers. Right, City are playing tomorrow. Yeah. Sorry. But yeah. Right, barely right with a throw in on the centre line. Um, he's going to go up the way. He's got to go up the line. They're going back, st stupid man. There you go. Up the line. The same's off his back, and hooked away by the defender into open space. With Durkin. Jack Clark goes back. Clark sweeping it up again. You want to see more from? What was that score, Jacob? <laughs> I mean, Ipswich are winning 2 0 away at Shrewsbury and Swindon are at home winning against Rochdale 2 0. So, do you think them results are looking likely to finish like that? Sims in the box. Sims in the box. Sims shoots. Too slow and. Just the wrong side of the post. Looking for, just chops inside, just trying to. No, I don't think that pushes anybody. I think that's just a hook shot just the left. Just off. Gary Bennett said he should have gone the for the far post. There we go. Should have gone for the, the far channel. post there, seems. Centre off getting dragged out. Just reverse it through his legs. Well, see, so you think keeper's beat it. Yeah. To be honest with you, he should, have, he should have made a better chance of that leg. Like. I mean, it's it's his decision in that moment. I, it was a decent effort either way. Um, what's happened to the new and improved Jim Atete, lads? Uh, he was brainstorming and he came on midweek. Um, he's been subbed off top. at half time. So. Ellis Sims. Can he get on the end of it? His day's done. What can he do with it? West Brom are now 3 0 up. Jack Clark. Jack Clark whips, yeah. tries to whip it in. It. Pritchard. Pritchard. Oh, give it back to Embleton. Might drop for Ross Stewart. Do it, Pritchard. It's pinging Shot around. Distance. Low distance. Oh, keeper must have seen corner. it late because no. knocks it out of the corner. Oh, it looks like it was easy. Yeah, well, that's Corey Evans again, isn't it? Uh, Leicester. Yeah, yeah, that was hot handling. He's sniffing me down as Nick as if he's counting. It's a little bit awkward for the keeper, maybe just bouncing in front of him there. Paris yeah, the fourth the ones are green yellow. Corey Evans having a shot on target for Sunderland half. as well. Like this is a much better second half from Sunderland. Much, much better. We've got to go for it, and we've got to go for it. I think resting on our laurels and, and defending for 45 minutes has been shit for us. So, yeah, 100%, we've got to go Richard for just it. Slowing it down as you would, you're in front, away from Alice have just scored. Slow the game Two down. One. Uh, a good corner in Pritchard, are we? Pritchard. It's gone. Drops this time, maybe for the, the first man heads it back in. Billy Wright's up there. Billy Wright in a second. Billy Wright's the most attacking player. Stumbles, goes down. Bielka. Tackled by Bailey Wright, so who's not happy Bailey with that. I think Jagiel was going uh, down. Just stuck under Jagiel. What an anticlimax fucking corner that was. <laughs> on top of it, let's have a look at it back now. Not leave for Crystal Palace, says Renan. Yeah, Palace 2, Villa 1. Shape. Oh. See it back now. He's going down now. He's from a 3 0 up against Hull. <laughs> bit of a clip on his right shin. Yeah. Uh, is their keeper a bit Lee Burge? Palace 2 1 up. What does that mean? 
Gooch competing. Like fluffy. Wins uh, kinda, it. yeah. Evans brings it down. That's you. I thought it was a bloody. You got we getting texts in or something? That's what you used to have on like the Samsung. A bit more composure yeah, to yeah, Those scrappy ones in the middle of the park. We picked up more of those already <laughs> at the start of this second half. And what uh, we did the first. What was that? In the pool. All the way. All the way. Bailey Wright goes to Wembley. <laughs> Come on, let's send the Sunderland fans home happy back up the M1. Good eye, good eye. They wouldn't go up the M1, mate. We would never touch the M1. Jack Clark now. It's the M6 to the M62 or M18 and the A1M. So the A1M, that's really what I'm right. thinking of. Yeah. The A1M. Of course! Then the A19. Before. What happened to the, the uh, yeah. Weatherby services? <laughs> <laughs> I've made that journey way too many times, mate. I'd, I'd back my hand now. Um, goal, Zaha, Palace 2 1. Brennan's happy with that. Down. Embleton emerges with the ball. Well, yeah, they're always a good, doing a good season out of Palace. They're always Not getting good results. Like play was on there, they? Palace are a team that shouldn't be where they are, really. Like, what have they done since they've been in the Premier League? I know. It's... I mean, they stayed up. When, when, when we went down to front Prem, they beat Hull City and stayed up. Still get the well. survival. Mm -hmm. Taken quickly. Apart from Bossu. that, I don't think they've. Into the area. They've done more. They've not done much. Corey they've Evans. got through to a semi-final in, in a cup, down. and that's it. It's like oh, Cheltenham, the winning against Exeter. <laughs> yeah, he flapped that shot. He could have chucked it out. Ooh, oh, yeah. QPR pressure. one one says Niall. Stewart nibbling away. Yeah, I think. Excellent fans, you can hear in good voice. I think QPR scored towards end at first half. Well, Stoke, yeah, Stoke fans, they think it's a foul there. What? Do, who? Who they level with? Baker, QPR, sure. Rotherham. Rotherham. One one, yeah. Let's have a look. They're clamming for a penalty, aren't they, Stoke? Oh, yeah, it looks like well, Bailey's facing his own goal, isn't it? So it looks Massive like frog the goes up Bailey. there, like. Here comes Sunderland. Oh, no. was, was it for a sending off here? Well, Alan Sims had the ball there. I think it was going wide. It's got to be a card, at least. Oxford 1-1, yeah. says Niall. You're getting replaced, Jacob. Come on, keep up. Peterborough 4-0. did get a yellow for something Shrimps. exactly the same in the first half. Cameraman's focused on Brown. Not sure if it's him that's involved after seeing... Yeah, shouting them a oh. winning. Finalists. Yeah, they were finalists, says Duns. Yeah, it is. It's brown. Over, the, over than that, be in the last decade, Palace have done nothing. So, to be yeah, fair, you could say that about Arsenal what? as well. But they won a cup. Tottenham, Tottenham yeah. They're West Ham. <laughs> Pritchard and Embleton stand God, it's over absolutely it. Pissing down distance, there, I am. There we are. You know, it's never stopped all afternoon. Nice. Well, but... Mm. Uh, Tom, Tom, Thomas Mitchell awesome says, "Hey, Anf and off. Earth, and hey, Jacob. Dude, Sorry, I'm late. No worries. Enjoy. How are you doing? Back. Back. back post. Oh, oh that's got to be a corner. For the corner. Mate, what yeah, is this so fucking the ref doing? Things. Danny Barton and Ross Stewart. I'm sure he clearly he helped it behind. Is he not for the corner? Stewart back. gets a hook on it. Yeah. Is it Brown? Brown is Brown back there. What are they? Need a second are, they, are they watching yeah, a different fucking game to us or not? To strike away and Brown's just got a toe on it. Is that is Nile? Is that an actual scoreline so or is that the actual? Is that your Gale prediction? West Brom three nil up. Former Newcastle player and it's that right. Yeah, Jacob already, Brownie's wow. made with last yeah. season's top scorer. We've already first change for Stoke. Said, said that. Yeah, I was expecting on. that. You know, yeah, that's so mad. First off, I thought they were maybe the better team, but. Uh, I would have expected that the other way around. Whole 4 0. That's clearly not happening. To but to the end, anyways. These fucking referees, like, they're just. There he is. Former Newcastle man. How Oof. the fuck that weren't a corner before? White Gill is on for Stoke, and Jacob Brown is off. God. 3 0. Are we sponsored by Yellow Card? <laughs> That's a good one, Dale. I like that, mate. I like that. Preston. Yeah, the. Yeah. Six years the Preston and Wigan game is still nil nil. I think that's the only nil nil still in the league. Uh, no, there's another one. Birmingham, Watford. That's good. Yeah, league one's been interesting. Plymouth are winning three nil. Away to Forest Green. 
and you don't get as much service. I'm trying to detox sort of myself so from League One. I don't know about any other ones. Boys in the um, but uh, there's a good question in, from Thomas here. Uh, what were you all recommend to the game so far? Um, we're we're yeah, doing better now in second half, Stewart. definitely. But mm -hmm. just referees being a typical Turkey. ref. Clark's away to his left hand side. He's waiting for him. Oh, 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 yeah, that's the that ball. Was a Maybe pass. Yard or so early. You see Jack. Forest Green Rovers are losing. A little three, no? between him and Dennis. Man United. But we don't fall. Well, for Plymouth. When it rains, it pours, right? What was that about Plymouth? Sorry. Well, for second goal, Bally Mumba got the second goal for Plymouth. Oh, okay. Didn't we have um, some London. links with him from... Kilkenny. Uh, yeah, not he's last on... season. Hamilton tries to steal it. To but he were at Norwich, wasn't he? We moved yeah. to Norwich and now we moved on to Plymouth. Yeah, I don't it, know why we... the video or the match is... Um, like, d d d d d d d d d d I don't understand why it's doing that. What, on Google Meet? Yeah, I, I still know. It's, it's not like on Google Meet or something. Everything else is fine, but the match is like, uh, fans, you I can, can watch it good just, voice down at it's the like, so it, could, it could be one of two things, mate. It could be your internet speed or it could be the RAM that is required from your uh, from your computer to process images on um The PC is powerful. I've got a, it's, a, it's a VR-ready computer. It's, it's a proper gaming PC. Really right. I don't yeah, but it's, it's available RAM. Here comes Sunderland. Pitchard. Southampton, 1-1. Oh, Gooch, Gooch down the same, Sims, Sims gets pushed in the back, feet. stays up, but it's out for throwing yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. about 12 yards from the corner flag. Sunderland on the attack, Sunderland on the ascendancy. That's what Sunderland should have done with our stripes, give them a little bit of a jazzed up a little bit like Stoke strip, isn't it? I really like Stoke's kit. Obviously, we use red and white stripes a lot, like having a bit of detail in it is nice. Last season's kit with that faded circle on the top, I didn't like it at the start, but now I'm kind of rating it. Another fucking yellow card? What is the matter with us, man? I mean, does it really matter? <coughs> You've got to go back. So it's 1 1 with Leicester and Southampton. Mm. Sunderland players, sixth in the oh. Adams. Okay. Hey, Adams. The game. Nice. Yeah. Uh, I'm glad I missed the first half on the video at Sound of the Pollen. Yeah, so the first half we did nothing. We had about a five minute spell in the 20, uh, the 20th to 25th minute, and then the goal. That was pretty much it. This this half, it's it's Challenge more end to end. And it's, it's more entertaining. But ultimately, the, the, only the, the, the only number that actually matters stroke. is the goals, and we're winning on that stat, so <laughs> who cares? Otherwise, I think we just need to cl uh, keep clean sheet now. Clean sheet is uh, what we... Oh, we better do the late goal. That'd be awful. What, we're on, fi we're oh, on five game. yellow cards, by the way, and they're on three. But players on the pitch with a yellow card, we've got three each. We don't want a we don't want a late um, a late goal, Jacob. Unless it's all ours. It's good again, just forcing Stoke to to play it long. You can see they're trying to play into that yeah, midfield three. In the card. One one. Passing it through there, Bailey White takes control. I remember who got cut, sent off for us last week. Has. Dan Neil. Do, do you think we've missed him in this game so far? Not really. Not really. There you go. <laughs> it didn't matter. <laughs> But it did on the night, but... Because you just couldn't find the return ball to Sims. Gooch trying to get this it's ball back. Kenny. He's going to commit a foul. I can just see it happening. He's going to commit a foul. Small ball. Goes inside. De Lapp. De Lapp's lucky to be on the pitch, in my humble Crossing opinion. Thompson. Passing comes and gets a good <laughs> hand to it. On his fast the yellow is going to wreck us. Most decisions are from incorrect. Was never hey, no, was good, over good the bottom as well. Committed, didn't he? Good fist on it. Uh, to throw, so I, say, I think five plus yellow cards it? is a big fine for the club. Foot. It's I think it's, it's five hundred pound for yellow card. It's a wild something like that. Over the top. Are you happy with the second half so far, lads? What you've seen? Yeah, the crowd inside the ground. Yeah, definitely. It's much better. It is much much better from from Sunderland. Like I said, it is more end to end. Uh, if you look at the just, if you just look at the stats, we went from um, three shots to nine. Uh, granted, only one more has been on target, but we only had one shot on target the entire first half. So yeah, this has got the promise of being a really good result for Sunderland. 
Um, I don't we're want to jinx not, it too we're early. We're certainly but... not just sitting back, though, are we? We're certainly not sitting back trying to do what we've done the last two home games. It's a little bit more relaxed now, Alex Neal, doesn't it? I think we... we did it in League One as well, well sitting back. Second half's so gone, 20 minutes into it now. I, I, I get that mentality from um, Alex Neal. If, like, if you sit back and Try defend and properly and solidly, you're fine. But I don't course. think we've got a, a squad and an outfit that can do that right Will now. Not. We need more signings to... Downfield assert themselves as a there. solid defensive partnership and go from there but we're not there yet the well. bring, oh, bring Michael Hector to Michael Hector Michael Hector why is he playing now? yeah, yeah he's at Fulham currently Stoke I think be looking to bring the is he looking to be on the way out or not? Dimaggio Wright Phillips came on and scored an equalizer. Yeah, released by so, Fulham. Yeah, so. we, He's 30 years old. Certainly look to his bench again in the yeah, next five minutes or so if nothing's happening for, for Stoke. Not a fan slagging Matetti off. Matetti is off. We're glad he's gone off and all that. Has he really been that bad, do you think? No. Um, I don't think that's. I don't think he's had the best game. I don't think he's had the best game. He was subbed off at half time. So was Lugo 9. And I think it's it's done us wonders, to be honest. Refreshing. Uh, so Billy right with the ball. Bit to Evans. Evans ball inside to Corey Evans, who knocks one over the top. Clark. Looking for Jack Clark to get on the end too. Clark can make this. Clark doesn't make it. It can go out for a Fossey goal picks kick. It up. A corner. Takes throw. it out. Some throw. And then throw by the corner Just flag. Good. It's good. I can't believe how many empty seats is at Stoke like. Spot from Corey, the lap drops with the three points to Wigan shot came down on the front on it. <laughs> I like the idea of that, like fucking, basically his shot going so far wide it goes in the fucking back of the net at the uh, the TW. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Got a powerful shot if you can make it travel more than forty miles, like. Nevertheless, it is. That hairstyle. Thank you. Aldorama. I only wear this when someone under underwinning, by the way, so... It is... 4-0, West Brom. 4-0, West, West, West Brom. <laughs> Why didn't I what do that? I say my what? predictions on that one? You said... The first half, Will Smallbone. It's Sam Klukas who returns to midfield. 0-0. Nil, nil. <laughs> well. Why did I say 0-0? Nil, nil? Uh, so you oh, went for a um, Norwich 2-0 win. A... Uh, a Wigan 2 0 win, a Burnley 4 0 win, a Watford 3 1 win, QPR uh, 2 0, uh, Reading to be 1 1, Chef to be 2 1 win, uh, Us to win 3 0, Swansea to win 3 1, West Brom to be 0 0, and tomorrow's game to be 2 2. Yeah. Looks like I'm. It looks like I'm more accurate than you are at the minute, mate. Yet again. <laughs> In the Premier League, Fulham two, Brentford two, and Palace three, Villa one. Oh, Pritchard looks to be in pain here. Uh, substitution for um, Stoke. Sam Clowkes is off for the small one. I don't know enough about these two players to be honest to make to say that's good or bad. In the Premier League. Um, yeah, three one. Sorry, one two. Fulham are drawing now with Brentford, and Palace have got a third goal. Okay, I wonder what yeah. that does for my fantasy team. <laughs> Probably fuck all, but you never know. Well, Ivan Tony scored for Brentford. He got the equaliser. Tyrese Campbell's gone up top with. Uh, yes. Just I try to avoid the Premier. I don't know why I try to avoid the Premier League. Like, looking at that that caliber of football of what players are capable of versus what I'm seeing at Sunderland just depresses me a bit. Um, because you like yeah, Luton. Have Luton of what? Sorry, mate. Just scored. Luton has scored again. Okay, is that two nil or two one now? Sorry. Two nil Luton. Two nil. Oh. Oh. Sheffield United have just scored a second 2 0 up. Yeah, it's good from Lyndon Gooch as well, firming the challenge there. Wins the throw it. I went with a 1 1 draw on that uh, on that Sheffield United game. United, yeah. Do you, just, do you, do you definitely think oh, we need more players in, though? Sure do you, do you, do you think we one. do need more additions? 
Yes, uh, we'd need more defensive oh, options. Uh, I don't think there's any Sunderland fans out there that don't think that. Uh, I think we need to sign an outright striker, though, because in case Ellis Sims gets recalled. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Say that again. I don't think I don't think Ellis Sims will be recalled by Everton, uh, even if they do start to the fuck it. up. You've got to remember time, there was talks with um, Broadhead as well. They might prefer Broadhead over Sims. We don't know what their outfit is. Whoa. How do you think Sims has done this uh, first oh, half? Was it last yeah. season? I think Luke what was the question? Who, how do you think who's done? Sims, I think, think he's done the second hoping, half. Hoping that Pato's given a um, shout and he's coming out behind To be him. honest, I think so he has now enough of the ball to, 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 in to influence my as well, didn't opinion on him this half. I think he's when he's had the touch of the ball, he's not had the greatest of opportunities. So, okay. Nothing outstanding. I don't expect him, if he continues like that, to get a goal. But he can flick a switch and bang them in whenever Passing. he wants. He scores when he wants. He scores when he wants. Ellis Sims, he scores when he wants. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ma Ma Thompson. Mate I can't say it. Why can't I say that name? Can you say that name Delan for me? The, the Crystal right, Palace first third goal then. scorer. Mateta? Uh, is it Mateta? Matey, mate, mate, <laughs> uh, Somebody say that. Oh, it's painful. It's painful. Mater. Um, Kyle is saying, for me, we need a goalkeeper, a right back, a centre back, a left back, a centre mid, a winger, and a striker. So basically, a whole new team. <laughs> players to be three players, three more players. Right. If we've only got the budget for one more player. Where are you getting that player? Fairly in? fortunate. We've seen some of the standards of the yellow cards. I mean, you look at Bailey Wright. I know we've we'll probably got a budget for like more me, wages. Going away from goal on the touchline. Yeah, we've, we've only got one. Gonna shit. Gives him a yellow card. That one there. Could easily go. Middle there. of park. Use I think. the hashtag park, on social media it. and have your say in the post-game program. Well, Just use the hashtag. Now. You don't have to at anyone on Twitter. Let's use the so hashtag. You're saying the centre mid. Pick it up. Our production team will pick it up. Your thoughts in the post-game program. What about you, DJ? What are you saying? Get a free kick for Sunderland. Going well, then. A player. Yeah, we've only got but see, yeah, we've only got budget like for one more player in in the in the squad. Which Clark position are they filling? Side. Definitely defenders. Oh. Uh, Jacob and Kyle Definitely are saying centre mid. So you're going centre defence, right back, left back. Where where are you going? Good job, plays it early. Um, Sims, can he get around it? I was in. Holds it up, looking for support. Embleton shoots. It's wide. Scuff shot. Personally, Niall saying defence. Sure, I'm going. I'm going as a uh, left back. I, don't, I think somebody who's a left wing back would be better for us long right term. Um, so look at it from this and angle. having from Pritchard switched on, doing people quick. like Luke Nine see there, they switched off in the middle. Stoke, Roberts, no one tracks Clark, Embleton. They're not defenders. Somebody who's a left wing back. back. Somebody that's I don't know, Danny Rose would be nice. Slices it wider that right side post as we look at it. Oh, Patrick Bernard, to be fair, somebody who's really big, strong, and fast. So that was when you got kids that wake you up early? When you wake up in the morning feeling like you haven't uh, had any sleep, it's because of kids. Lucas. <laughs> the kids. Oh, Summer bless her, she <laughs> was up at like down anyway. half seven this morning. Yeah. Little monkey. Well, when, oh. when, you're, when you're a grand... Her granddad or grandma, Another your grandkids, when, when you, what you the guy is, your grandkids, the they're just like the kids, but you can get given back when you're fed you up. Give them back at all. Yeah, that's, right. that's the benefit of being an uncle, mate, as well. Right, Phillips, <laughs> going to make way <laughs> to the pitch. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so we are about to hit the 75th minute of the game. 15 minutes left. Ooh. Ratings out of 10. Bit, bit of a different question, but it's in essence, how do you think the game's going, but... Out of ten, Sunderland performance. Go. I'm giving it um seven, second half especially. Stokes fourth change. Yeah, go for seven. First half, I'm going to go for Two. four, one <laughs> half. <laughs> so you're basically saying the second half is a ten out of ten. Is that coming off? It's uh, <laughs> Liam Delap who's making no, way. I, I'm going for a six to be honest. Um, yeah, I thought he looked a handful, wasn't he? Sharp, beyond our goal, I don't think we've been. About. Whether he's taking him off there, he hasn't had anything too much in, in, above in, average. In um, I think goal, he's been bang on uh, average pretty much his entire game. Yellow card and that one Frank ago, Phillips is on, he... off. Well, we're in. I've on got two new ones. Ellis Sims. Ellis Sims. Someone just said, is Ross, is Ross Stewart well, he's signed? He's signed a couple of times. Yeah, he's had a couple of them. He's signed a couple of contract, at, uh, yeah. Bristol City as well. Mm -hmm. I know he got yeah. a couple of goals, but there was not yet. Not yet, man. It was his first goal where it wouldn't sit for him. 
Burnley three, Blackpool two. Blackpool three. West Brom four, Paul one. Oh, Thompson. Well, yeah. we got a goal back. As you say, a full change is made now. Yeah. Mold by the so no, Not really. <laughs> Do you think they're getting four goals back or not? Or three more goals? We've got three left, haven't we? We've got ten yeah. minutes left. All the fans do is you get mauled by the Tigers. They do that they gesture at the away fans. Three they go like that. Oh, you're getting mauled by the Tigers. Yeah. That's kind of day. sad. <laughs> That's kind of sad. Oh, I wonder if this works. Let me see if this works. You think Stoke are defending all right then? Uh, yeah. I th to be fair, I think both teams, if you take out the one Stuart goal out of this game, both teams for me are getting wide right at the Let play go on. Bang average. Stewart go on. Overhits it. Oh, what was fucking... I don't know, there, but Dan Neal... Oh, Dan Neal. Delivers one early towards Sheffield Stewart. Let's punch. Not very convincingly clear. 3-0 Sheffield so United. Come again. 3-0. I, I just got the wrong Gooch player. He's not, Dan Neal's not even on the pitch. <laughs> Still going Linda Gooch. Goes down. Not he he ran into right, five Stoke players by himself there. What do you think he was going to achieve with that? Crowd cheer them on. Yeah. Blackburn are doing what we did against Sheffield United. They're losing 3 0 now. So. Blackburn go from winning 3 0 to losing 3 0. The week. A tussle going on there. What the so fuck is happening at the back? Dwight Gale, it is. Dwight Gale, yep. Yeah, it's done well. The line. Well, MK Dons are drawing to Atkins. Did you see at that at the back of the pitch? Dwight Dwight Gale, at the back of the pitch with Dwight Gale. It might show you. He yanks his arm and pulls him down. It might show you back. But it should be a yellow card. He's off the ball and his hands raised. We've hit 20 likes, guys. Thank you, likes, guys. Thank you very much. Legends. Someone's just said this game should have been put to bed. Some good chances gone begging. Burnley and Blackpool, 3-3. Yeah. It's going to show you this incident now. Go see. Piece of Dennis's arm pulls him down. Yeah, Blackpool have the linesman has a word with the referee. Go on, Jacob, sorry. 3-3, three, three, Blackburn place. and Burnley. I'm sure what's going on. That's an interesting score. What are Burnley up to? You always get matches like this in the Championship. It's a very... Tight league. That sort of yeah, it's a tight league. It, it, it should be called... Oh. <laughs> Niall's saying, at half-time, the stadium messed up, the, um, messed up and the, yeah, the, the stoke badge on. and the Barrow badge up. Billy right there. Sheffield United have gone three and up. up. They're looking good, Sheffield down by Campbell that time. Oof, Nottingham Forest scored against Everton. And it's Have they that. really? Yeah. Send, me the, send me the link. The booze around the ground, not sure. What they're on about there. Uh, Werder Bremen scored three goals in the last six minutes to beat Bro Borussia Dortmund. Like That's a fucking impressive exactly, play, yeah, though. So. I'd like to see Nottingham do well this season. I don't want them going back down. Some of the fans are still good in good voice as what, well. Nottingham? Sold out a way yeah, until a lot of that this season. And every season. I'll tell you what, Sheffield United are going well, aren't they? They are, but it's to be expected, mate. To be, to be. They will be happy. Oof, Southampton well, trying to drop it off for Pitchard. It's not very right. Direct, Could you imagine the, the Premier League with Stoke, back, Sunderland, Stoke. Sheffield United, oh, Brentford, well, <laughs> and Southampton? Yeah. Five red and white teams. So we the ball. It'd be like, <laughs> the fuck do you support? <laughs> the red flag fly now for which team? Well, Southampton have just scored. They're winning. Oh, the possible two, opportunity there for Sims. I think we're having a bit of a clock and get out there. The ball's played oh, on the top. So this might be trouble at the other end. Dwight Gill brings it down. Oh, oh and it's oh. gone over the top. <laughs> of Anthony Patterson's goal. <laughs> Dwight Gill shied. Fucking hell. Just direct from the key. He's on the stretch, as you say, Jagger. The latter oh, fell on Daddy Bar. Short. He takes his hand down. He's got a one on one with a keeper. Big opportunity for Dwight Gill. He scores it. Catches it on the bounce, doesn't he? The long. Chances are coming for there. The it comes up his knee. I wonder what's up. worse. Torres' his miss against Man United for Chelsea or this. I think that. He, he fucking shinned it. <laughs> well, with Torres at Chelsea oh, against Man U when he's messed that up. Oh, yeah. When he's it's getting to that final squeaky ten minutes time of again, isn't time. it? Stoke City <laughs> Sunderland I, I won. I genuinely think we might do what we did in the first half. Over the top from Embleton. Sims is there. Keep that keeper looks like he's flapping. Doesn't go very far. Wasn't convincing, was it? You never know. Every time I'm it's on the stream, it, we could throw. win. Yeah, oh, you're the good luck charm. 
Sure. Where's yeah, the goalkeeper? Surely just Lola. Just take the ball in. Need air on. Just, good, yeah. but just, just take the ball in. I don't think he does punch it. Comes up with a strange decision. Bit of a volleyball shot. It's worked pretty much this. Yeah. And she wasn't in the room for Sheffield. We end up losing. So. Let's get her up here. Was she there for Bristol City? Did she get an appearance for that? Uh, she, yeah, she did. She was just uh, a sleeper for the entire game. She was bored. I think when she sleeps for the entire game, it's a, it's a draw. <laughs> I think she got an appearance for QPR, but we didn't win that. What's the stats? How many fouls have we yeah, given away yeah. compared to the ball? Yes. Kicking the ball away. Yeah. Here we go. Are you foul, ready? No, like, but then he's moved on. the ball into the crowd. 11 to 12. There you go. Yeah, we love you, Lola. Yeah, yeah. We do. Do you know she's a short girl as well, Jacob? She was a short Lola. It's quite a little dog, isn't she? Lola, she is a show girl. Looks astonished. Oh, bless Good girl. Good girl. Right, she'll be in the room now, so that's good. It is, it just leans into the back of Klukas, isn't it? There you go, darling. Side of him. <laughs> Wins that one. Mate, what is this fucking foul? Ball, yeah. Sorry. As that happens. Oh, oh dumb. Stands towards the back post. It's got a glance in him. Nah, it's, 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 it, you can tell it's, it's not a corner. Good from that, mate. Corner for Storff. Set pieces, oh, though. If we fuck up on the set, set piece yet again, again, I'll not be happy. 83rd minute. Oh. Tickle my tits till Nail Friday. Sunderland <laughs> till Friday. It's only fucking Saturday now, mate. You got six days of it. Baker. Final score could Six's be 1 0. Floated in. Head of the be far post. Sunderland, it could be 2 0. It could be. I think. Fossey. I'd take it. I'd it fucking down. take it. Um, I think 3 1 from the breath back. back. Where's your predictions? The so, back on top. there's only Van Fish that went for a 1 0 win for Sunderland. Into the 80s, you look a little bit nervous looking at the clock. Fine, I'm a full pint, if that's true. Uh, uh, your your 3 1 win, Jacob's very unlikely now. Yeah. DJ's 3 0 is unlikely. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised it's still Preston nil, Watford nil, mind. He was a bit raw. Where have you gone? Taylor, bit mad, mad didn't he? When, when we scored, I bet he were going absolutely bonkers. They met in a Wickham's club. Wickham's just got a Sunday. third. Oof. Well, Swindon are winning 3 0 against Rochdale in League Two. These teams, man. They, they, I do not want to see them ever again. Unless they're looking for Jack Clark. Also ready for it. Oh, it yeah, was shocking when we were in League One. They were not good now at all. Their defence was. Off the West Brom 5 1. 5 1. Taylor. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that <laughs> was, what, what a day to be a West Brom fan. Imagine, oh, imagine this is what they judge the Steve Bruce on. Not, not what he's done in the other games. This five-one. Who else has done yeah, a five-one win? <laughs> he likes Greg's, does Steve Bruce? Doesn't he? He likes his Greg's. He's got players furious. It's a foul. <laughs> it's it's like... free kick. There's nothing more than that. He's just gone off with the header. Uh, no, thank you, bet. Uh, you can yeah. line bet. You can, you can, with a one-one level, and that that's not happening. Hopefully not. Uh, tie dye course starts soon in Carlisle at DJ's pad. <laughs> cheap rates, <laughs> money off guarantee. Go, Wigan. One nil, Wigan. Balls are coming in. That Wigan won earlier from the Philippines League. Azcal's four, Maralika nil. I, I really wanted away. to know that one, mate. Thank you. Pritchard <laughs> dispossessed. <laughs> Stewart tries to get it back. Now back a little bit, perhaps. Play continues. Embleton. It's scrappy now. Down the line. Very scrappy so now. We can't keep the ball. Keep the ball. No. Uh, yeah, Fossey. It's, yeah. Floats it in. It's looking very Getting similar. Flicked on by Gale. Serkins oh, there. Near from Broad. It's in the air again. Goes out for throw into Stoke. Against Birmingham. So. This has got to feel a Coventry City game at home, isn't it? They're slowly coming back into it, Stoke. Oh, God. To be fair, mate. No, Stoke have been this exact amount of momentum the entire game. They're very consistent. I think we're just getting a bit more... It's part of the bus, um, oh, which is work with us though, park in the bus. It, it's Everyone just naturally what happens. I Ryan don't Phillips. think this is this is the intention of Alex Neil. Thompson gets across in left. It's footed. just what's happening. You got to look how many people are in our box now. What are you doing? Everton are back in their game now. <coughs> <Yeah. coughs> 
Buzz D and B one yeah, one and uh, and a win grand cash. And back in there by or Jackie cash out for 100, 150. Billy Wright gets Cash out now. Head. Cash out while you've got that offer. Gooch, it's clear. not going to be one one. It's not going to be one one. Got I'm, wearing, I'm wearing the chance. fucking wig. It's not going to be one one. It's not up. Right. <laughs> Sullen steal it back though. This is Ellis Sims. Corey Evans just to the left of him. Give it to Corey. Corey. Right. It's Corey, Corey Evans. Come on, drive Evans. Him. Back to Sims. Trying to give it back to Sims. Oh. Just in front of him. Weak. Sims can't get full possession yeah. of it. Weak. Problem there once he rolls out to Corey. Yeah, Corey's looking up in the middle. There's no one, one in there. Now. Ross is oh, trying Everton to get forward. But Sims that's played into him. Right. Tries to pull it back forward. Oh, oh Birmingham City nil. Wigan 1. Nathan Broadhead. Wigan Athletic. Right foot shot from outside the box. Wigan with 10 men. Anthony, you said it wrong. Broadband. Broadband, oh, sorry, Jack yeah, yeah. BT Broadband. Yeah. Took the shot on. <laughs> we assumed his name, that's... Uh, you can't assume his name. Oh, Sam Lucas. Can't Broadband. It's, he's, it's Fulham 84 now. It's 86. Yeah. Slick move this from Stoke. Cash out. Oh, Jack Clark, who's back there yeah, defending well Danny. There. Done really well there, Jack Clark. Good position. Mix it off Three, two, Fulham. Okay, now that's... Touch, what, what's with the high-scoring games just not being ours today? Be another sub. I think it's a oh, Sunderland sub. Yeah. substitution, 87th yeah. minute. Hume coming on. Arsenal's on. I, I, hate watching Arsenal. Arsenal. I don't know what it Jagger is. I just hate watching Pritchard Arsenal. They're right. on late. Which uh, are making way. I think it was Trey Hume I saw on the touchline a moment ago. I like yeah. Arsenal fans. Me, Robbie. That was total was wank. Fucking tabbed with no filter. Bogan, yeah. Oh, it was a player sent off for Burnley and a player sent off for Blackpool. Oh, yeah, handbags are out. Is. Handbag shame, FC. Shame. There you go. Tie-dye <laughs> <Tide -dye laughs> FC. Handbag FC. What, what are we going, going for now? Granny's Knickers FC. Then he got in trouble. Yeah. Well, trouble here for Sunderland. Oh, Pritchard. Pritchard doing the job there. The deflection wasn't there as it made its way to, Sims. to Patterson. Drive well, past Sims the player finds himself or with it. the ball, though. The other end tries it. to play it. a ball over the top for Ross Stewart. He might get Stewart there, Ross Stewart. He has got there. Ross Stewart, Come he's on, found the shoot, keeper. Bitch. He took it too far shoot. to the left. He shoots. Oh, oh my God. What the wide. Oh. 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 Chance to put the game to bed. As you say, it's a lovely ball over the oh. top. Gets oh. there oh. before the keeper, doesn't he? Fortunately, he just goes wide. Mate, he had it open goal. What did he do? Whack his foot at it. He didn't take it too wide. The ball momentum was going faster than he could keep up with it. Too much on it. This will be the angle. There's been a goal at Hull City. It's 5-2 now. Shows the composure. Far food, darling. Bend it round the keeper. Scratch me for food. Fortunately, it goes past that far post. Meanwhile, still uh, go again. City will be a we've got, bit you've got two things going in our favour, guys, by the way. You've got me with the big one, and you've got Lola here supporting us. Look. Stuart Mike Phillips. Have that man. It's a shot away. Blocked by Danny Bart. Have you seen West Brom's it's result? It's 5-2 now. It's caught out wrong uh, side, I think. Anybody putting a bet on it's West Brom being 5-2? <laughs> How much money are you earning today? How the fuck Stuart missed that? I'm just seeing the replay on the big screen here. Open game. Yeah, could be five for the match. It should be 2-0 Sunderland now. Should be. Game management and a bit of composure. That was the best yeah, shot that was. I was back in the arse that like. They've been in winning positions five, a lot of times this season so far. Five, five. Passing goes down. Got no food, darling. Let's take the sting out of these last couple of minutes with a bit of crap. I think it's one of them and the keeper can't go off, isn't it? Go down. Total wank again. <laughs> Two seconds. Now, Bear with Campbell me just down the right one hand side. minute. The selection there. Patel thinks that Danny Bart's going to get something. He does, and it's a... Yeah. He pulls it away, doesn't he? Yeah, just pulls it away. Yeah, <laughs> on the stretch. Tramping them calves, it's tough for a goalkeeper when you've got yeah, 5k. Yeah, Everton 1-1 against Nottingham. Uh, right, we're in the 89th minute. What a break for Sunderland, obviously. Afternoon all, it's says DJ Earth, SCFC, rather than saying it out loud. <laughs> Still organising. Uh, I, I reckon about the six sword. minutes added on, I'd say, second half. A few uh, subs. Right, I'd probably say, there. yeah, four or five. Four or five minutes to go up on the board. Danny Collins agrees with me as well. Four or five minutes. Um, I don't understand the sub. Are we dro we are dropping time. deeper as it takes and fill around for defender? Uh, to be fair, I think it might just be a cards thing. Added on for changes. Five yeah. minutes added, says John. Welcome along, John. Have you ever noticed in Alex Neal's post-match interviews he says listen a lot? Five minutes yeah. added time. Yeah. That was sent that yesterday, didn't he? Three points. Man, what was that pass? What was that pass? 
We need a manager who you know, just says it how it is. We, 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 you know, not sugarcoat it or anything like that. Studio. Listen, listen. listen. Crappy game, in, in my opinion, doesn't seem to be much set place as my castle. And the day yeah, the result that matters, isn't it? It is a scrappy game. It is, as he says. Remember the performance at the end of this season, though. Just remember the three points club. with this game. You want to keep it a clean yeah. sheet. Mm -hmm. So, is it going to be two away well, wins this season so far? Can we hang on, lads? What do you think? Isn't that the same amount we got when we got relegated? Really right, strong at the. Hey, Ant, there's no, uh, there's no way I can see Stoke scoring here, like. Thompson Fuck off, you in. dickhead. <laughs> header from Campbell. Mate, they just had a header at goal. So you need to stop this shit. <laughs> I can't see Stoke scoring at all, though. <laughs> 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 I'd be happy with that if it's a... You're ruining it? You know, floating oh, cross coming in. It's 3-0. What's 3-0, sorry? The QPR game. Campbell, isn't it? Take it, what was 3-0? Uh, it's which away at Shrewsbury. There you go. Perfect. So we look, we've got, we've got one person with a perfect scoreline. Van Fish, 1-0. Full-time Luton. Full-time Southampton. Sunderland one. There's a Sunderland faithful. The we are the, the Sunderland. The Sunderland boat boys. So are you mental? How are you mad? What a result for Southampton against Leicester. Jordan Thompson. Is it down the line? We didn't win. Two up DJ back. said that last minute and then we didn't win. Yeah, so. Not very nice. Three minutes of silence. Three minutes of silence. Huge. There's no way they'll score. I don't know care what you say. There's just there's no way they're going to score. Last few minutes, one of few of those headers, isn't he? Balls coming in. Sun and them on about. Forward. DJ, think, DJ, DJ don't jinx it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Three minutes remaining. Fulham three, so Brentford time. two at full time. Oh, steals it there for Sunderland, but Run still up. come again. And as you say, there's a runner, but Dennis Serkin does really well. I think back off if, there. if there's any other, if there's any goals in this, if it's going to be a Sunderland oh, counter attack. Because it's all pressure from Stoke. They're leaving huge gaps at the back. Um, but realistically, it's probably just going to end 1-0. Any man Which of the I'm match for Sunderland? How, are you going to go for man of the match, Stuart, again? Um, Could I, I actually am. Um, I see think Stuart has been our Rubens one left. beacon of absolute quality today and determination as well. So, yeah, I think if Stuart doesn't get man of the match, I'll be massively surprised. Who are you going for man of the match? What do you guys think in the chat? Any man of the match? match any man of the matches for you lot on chat? Yeah, take that. Pressure off. Oh, you, you're Who's saying Stewart as well, out? I'm guessing, DJ. What about yeah, you, Jacob? 365 Stadium. Yeah, I'll go with Stewart. Yeah. Lot Nest Robber. Not the Sunderland fans there. Um, there's, a, there's, a, there's a strong shout for Patterson in there as well, though. He's had a brilliant game. He yeah. had a scrappy fa first like, five, Jack ten Clark. minutes, but Throws it down the line. Um, he hasn't let the goal in, which is ultimately Stewart what he needs to do as a, um, as a keeper. Going for the goal kick. Yeah. Would um, this be a good win, the Nantes? You think it's, it's, it's three points, mate? Any, any, any wins a good win? Ten for survival this season. Any it's wins a good win, mate? Especially. Bounce field, isn't it? Downfield it goes back. What you need? Good. You enjoyed yourself, Should Jacob, the first uh, stream. Yeah. Thompson. Good luck. I hope I've done a good job with the scores, because. Right, Phillips. Can't get past oh Bailey Wright. Oh my God, Bailey Wright, the little. He just needs Rick to in the wall. For wow. Ellis Sims can't hold it up. Yeah, uh, Danny Bath is the man already. of the match for Kyle. Um, Jake Pickford is in the final minute Stewart as time. well. Uh, man in the match City, uh, for the referee won. for not giving Sunderland the red card. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody giving the referee the man of the match is... Kick and that should... <laughs> See the clock run yeah, down a bit this, further. We've done very this. close. We've done this. To another away win We've done in the Sky Bear Championship. Uh, Tam saying it's either the keeper or Rod Stewart for me on Once the second again, half. Once again, Danny, some have proven there. Neil Preston and Watford full time. Very competitive at this mm. level. Yeah, showed some I haven't seen the game yeah, off, uh, because uh, we were, I... We weren't at our best, were we? Because uh, I can't, but I'd either see Clark or Patson or Stewart. Clark's no bad shout. I don't think he's been clinical in some of his crosses, which... Brings him down, but he has put the effort in. Final 15 seconds or so. Jack Clark wins the back. He'll probably go, go to the corner put flag. The in. Corner flag. Nine seconds left of the game. Goes down get and it goes for a. The yeah. referee's seen fine. enough. Balls, way, Full time whistle. Who's ring round? Oh, Ben's sheets. Six five, but not from this end. end. We have Michael a been happy <laughs> with the victory. Yes, lads. This afternoon. Played on. Played on. 
He'll be happy with oh, second half in particular when for oh, Sunderland, Danny. Well, yeah. Another big three points for Sunderland. Yeah, yeah. got to grind it out sometimes. How it's, it's not pretty. Welcome along. Say they're scrappy games. Um, at times, and a lot of yellow cards, a lot of fouls. Uh, Uneventful game as well. for the most part. We had to dig in. We were what, happy with that. on the back foot, especially in that first <laughs> half. Uh, get we get in. We win. It's the run of plays. We get in. Too much going get in, lads. I'm just going to keep on clicking the on these until we get. Right. So we've already gone through man in the match so far. I'm going to just mute Danny Collins because he's cracked me a bit now. Um. He settles us down a little bit in there. He Oats. picks up a lot of those second Instant balls. reflections. What are you going for? And, uh, and, and Bailey as well coming on at the back. He was, he was strong. And, and happy, was well obviously, happy with the three, three points. We, I think we all are. <laughs> Some of fans. Do you think we, we could do that today, week in, week out? Do you think that kind of well gameplay is so, good for us? You know, congratulations to Patrick yeah. We're just... As long as the openings come and as long as we put them away, I should have got the second, but at the end of the day, we'll get the chances and we're clinical with... With, with them yes, and then that's the all that matters. Ross, Stuart, we'll just it's that scoreline. That's all I'm bothered about at full time. Down it's that line. However many weeks or we'll days that we um, Danny, we stay at right now, one nil wins, I'm I'm chuffed. Um, like you said, as soon as we get that 50 point mark, the better. That means we're guaranteed to stay in this league this this season next season. There's no there's no way Sunderland will gone down. I'll tell you now. There's absolutely no way they will. There's worse customers in this league. Reading, Re I think Reading, Huddersfield, and Rotherham. They'll go down. I don't know about Rotherham, mate. Rotherham are, are pretty, pretty decent at the minute. They're they're, they're undefeated. Yeah. They, they've not been beat. That but kind Coventry of bottom of the league. Middlesbrough second off bottom. Yeah, Middlesbrough have got outfit, three draws. Good outfit, Coventry, you know. Yeah, but they haven't played any games because of the stadium. So I, I really think with Coventry, they might go down purely on points deduction because. It's got it. It's got to take into account, right? Um, should have cashed out at one forty. I agree. So mate. Take over everywhere we go. Oh, everywhere we go. Awesome lads and you free. Also, thank, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> First smash and half grab. That'll do. Thirty three in Burnley game. Everywhere we Our go. free free in Burnley, Burnley game. Everywhere we go. Bill Robertson on the but. Who would have seen us fifth game in? Oh, this... get I know. In. Yeah, we're fifth in the table after after five games. That's a nice little. Uh, well, it feels it feels better than last Saturday, and uh, doesn't it? Without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah. Can you imagine how remember how deflated we were this time? We were sitting there like with our Me mouths too. open, saying, "What the fuck happened there?" Yeah, it's much much better, and I'm really ten times more happy with what we've done today than we've had in the last. Well, and now we're draws. So, yeah, you're right, mate. Uh, back in the top six, that's good enough for me. Top yeah, up to yeah, fifth yeah. in the league. Free free in the Burnley game after a two-goal lead. Like, it's awful being that far ahead and then end up drawing. Hello, children. Don't forget anybody What's on in the, the chat. What multiverse um, of madness am I wearing? You can wear it if you want. Click the subscribe button on Ant's <laughs> channel. Um, Jacob Aviard's channel, if he's got one, I'm sure he has, hasn't he? Um, and do it myself, DJ, if you can give the subscribe button to click if you haven't. Give the lads a support on the on the <laughs> channel, but uh, I'm happy with yeah. that. Yeah, thank you very in. much. We we won the game, by the way. Yes. <laughs> I don't do you, 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 do you want to come on camera or not? Go, go. Yeah, that one. Somebody coming on camera. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. We won the game. <laughs> Hello. Yes, Hello. we're fifth in the league. Well, very happy. And whenever my team are winning, I wear that hat. That's why it's in the multiverse of madness. And who's this we're speaking oh, to, Anne? This is Hunter. And just just the arm in frame is Envy. <laughs> <laughs> are you doodling? So we're about to go play lots of games of Fortnite because we're happy now. And watch a movie, aren't we? Yeah, he's going to... <laughs> well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tie dye my neighbour's curtains and I'm just going to do it live in the back garden because it's pissing down out there, so it'll work really well. Okay, okay. we like Fortnite, we like Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the tie dye FC is going to be there. Coventry is going to be busy. Coventry, I think, might have to forfeit some of their games as well. That's that's the delicacy of it. Because if teams say, no, we can't fit it in because we've got cup, cup ties to, to fulfil... They're screwed. We've got to do it. 
And injury could see us in trouble. We lose Pritchard and Ross and big trouble. And yeah, agree. Right. Sorry, sorry about that. Thank you very much, everybody, for being here. It's been awesome. Um, yeah, it's been a nice Saturday afternoon. Fantastic. Um, we're, we're doing, uh, obviously, you've got the links for DJ and Jacob in the comment section below, the, the about bit. Um, we're on Monday Night Football as well. Are you, are you okay to join that one as well, Jacob? Or you... I think he said he's going to try and make it. Going to try and make uh, it, yeah. We'll, we'll, you know as well, you know as well we are if he, if he's so yeah yeah just, just there's nothing not to worry about and not worry if you can it so uh, yeah ping on Mondays yeah ping me a message if you want to get involved on Monday if not yeah. it's fine um because I couldn't press the link on there so I might have to go in the chat on the stream and do it that way join yeah fair enough mate if it, if it's um we'll we'll work it we'll work it out close to the time um logistics <laughs> so yes see you on Monday night football. And um, yeah, yep. I wear the lines. I wear the lines. Enjoy your weekend. I am. Oh, he's gonna tie dye his curtains. <laughs> <laughs>